Are you ready to start? Yeah, I think I am. All right, three, two, one, go! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> okay, time to head back out into the field and restock. Yeah. We're literally two items from go mode. We need fire arrows and the Goron Lullaby. Talk on it. Another thing that always happens is it always unbinds my controller C stick. I have to re input that like every time. Mm, yeah. That's annoying. Let's see. I think we want to go and grab a bunch of items and restock stuff. And I also want to pick up that Chateau Romani. That's, uh. Ooh, yeah. Uh, so, easiest way is go to. Is the one that's on the. I'm going to grab the one that's on the log just in Southern Field. Oh, okay. Just hook shot up to it. Oh, yeah, that's easy. I'm gonna get it on top of the pillar outside of East Clock Town. Right. That one's a little tougher for me because my emulator does not display the grotto, nor does it display the um, handholds. I mean, I didn't even realize the handholds were there until I started doing randomizer. <laughs> yeah, like, I never realized you could climb on top of that pillar because my emulator cannot display n neither the handholds nor the actual hole itself, so... It's completely that's, inconspicuous. That's so weird. Is that like a graphics setting, or is that literally just your emulator? It's just, it's just, uh, it's just a graphics thing with the emulator. Like it just can't do it. It can't display grotto entrances, and it can't display certain other textures that are just exactly lined up with the ground weird. or the wall. Well, I got infinite magic for now, oh, so that's right. pretty cool. Slow time. Also, if the Anju and Cafe side quest ends up having one of those required items, you are going to need to go to Pinnacle Rock. Oh, to get yeah, there's something required because, for it there? Well, the Cafe Mask, which is needed for a lot of the side quest, is... Um, I believe you get that for making the chickens grow up. And, oh, and, you, and, and to the, get the Bremen, the Bremen Mask, mask is, is at the bottom of Pinnacle Rock. Ah, bummer. Will it actually, you actually need to clear the thing out? You don't, no, it's just in the chest that's at the bottom. Uh, okay. Okay, okay, let's see. What else was I, I gonna do here? There's right, also drink one, the Romani. There's one cheeky thing we might end up having to do where we might have to go to the Beneath the Well maze and find the hot spring there and then take that warp to the frozen area and use that on some of the ice over here. Yeah. Oh my gosh, wait, I'm a, Hopefully poor, not. I'm a poor man. I need to go to the bank before going to Goron Shop. Silly old bear. At least we know where some of the blue potions are, if I yes. could recall where they were, that is. That's that reminds me, I never did go to the Goron part of Pirate Fortress. Oh yeah, that's right. Pirate Fortress inside yeah, one of the yeah. one blue potion in there. That's probably the easiest one to get. I refreshed myself on where basically everything is, and we always have the spoiler if we need a reminder. Okay, let's grab a fairy in a bottle, just so I have it. So because I still only have six hearts. I mean, I got double defense, but it's oh, not yeah. a lot of life. I actually, I might end up defeating Wart in the Secret Shrine just to get double defense. Yeah, if you did, then don't you have like 11 or 12 hearts right now? You'd have, I have plenty I have for the rest the of the first, I have two hearts on the bottom row of heart containers. So you got so 12. Yeah, 12. that's, if you got double defense, that's more than enough for the rest of the game. Yeah. The only, the only fights that I might be worried about without double defense are Majora if we don't get Fierce Deity Mask and potentially Twin Mold if we don't get Fierce Deity or Giant's Mask. Yeah, Twin Mold, I've never fought him without um, Giant's Mask, so that sounds like it might actually be kind of hard, because you'll have to be it, pretty it, accurate it, with it, your bow. Yeah, and remember that Ice Arrows do extra damage against the Red Worm, and Fire Arrows do extra damage against the Blue Worm. I never knew that. Oh, yeah. Those special elemental aerial arrows take them out in just a couple shots. That's good to know, because yeah. see, I would have just tried hitting them both with Light Arrows the whole time. Ah, uh, that, that is, that does seem to be the logical thing, but no. <laughs> okay, let's see, I got a stick, I got some Deku nuts. The, the baby Goron, instead of crying, is making like the rrr, rrr, rrr sound over and over again. <laughs> and here we go, powder keg. <coughs> okay, uh, honestly, I think I have enough supplies. Might as well buy Mask of Sense as well, I don't think it's used for anything. You never know. Hmm. Who knows? We might want to trade. It. We might want to explore some of the moon areas. For all we know, the um, <laughs> Fierce Deity's mask could be tied up in the moon. That is true. That is very possible. Another thing is, it, it could potentially end up that one of us gets to the moon before the other, so we could kill time, basically, exploring the moon area. 
smoke. Give me some, give me some arrows, please. There See, we go. I, I guess I could put a second fairy in a bottle, because why not? Don't think I'm going to need the fairy for anything else. That's right, we get to hear Koopa's Road for the entire dungeon here. Alright, the place is... No, no, it's not upside down. It flips back to normal when you leave. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I might as well get the fairies while I'm here, because we might end up needing them. I mean, you can't reach all of them without the fire arrows anyways, so... Oh, right. There's at least one that's, like, behind ice, isn't there? There's, a, there's one or two, yeah. Alright, I'm gonna do target practice with Romani, see if that leads anywhere. Hey, girl. <laughs> I won't say my name. <laughs> also, Romani, I am not wearing green clothes, so Grasshopper is not a fitting name. Oh, cool, the alien music is the same. I actually like that. <laughs> no, I don't know the most efficient way of destroying all the Poe balloons, but I don't care. I like that you can play the LG of emptiness with only the uh, C buttons. Yeah. I just like the pattern that I make on my control stick with it. <laughs> I also like. How I just the... do right, left, right, and then a one, then run full rotation. It's kind of nice. Love, I also love how the Deku statue is completely useless because it's not heavy enough to weigh anything down. Yeah. Are we sure we need fire arrows for Stone Tower Temple? There are definitely a couple of eyeballs that you need to shoot that are behind. Oh, frozen place. eyeballs. Frozen eyeballs, yeah. I'm not sure if you need it to actually beat the dungeon, especially with random a uh, randomizer, but definitely to get all the stray fairies, you need them. All right, what you giving me, Romani? Oh, fire arrows are at Romani Ranch. You got to do the practice. I like how this real bomb chew near the entrance tends to just get stuck down here. Like, it usually gets stuck on some- it, like, it sees you and starts charging towards you, but almost always gets stuck on some part of the structure. <laughs> oh, were you talking about the real rats with the bombs? Yeah, the real bomb chew near the start. <laughs> nice. Alright, well, change of plans. I'm going to Great Bay Temple. Really? Why is yeah, that? Yeah, because I can clear it now. Because I just found fire arrows. And then it almost always finds its way off the structure and hits me while I'm trying to aim an arrow. I hate that guy. <laughs> oh boy. And because we still need Guan Lullaby, I'm gonna have to collect the stray fairies as well. Oh boy. <laughs> it's kinda interesting you hear Cooper's road in this uh in this place. <laughs> that is fun. Yeah, it's a fitting enough theme for the place, I guess. Yeah. Also, I don't need it, but it kind of would help if I had um, a better sword than the regular one, other than the Great Fairy Sword. I would not say no to the Gilded Sword. Uh, yeah, if I recall, I did get the Gilded Sword. Um, oh, uh, it's uh, the Rosa Sister Tabit. Oh, oh, that's right. Yeah. Did you did you get Kimari's mask though? I don't remember I do, where I that is. I do not is. have Camaro's mask. No, but I. I, I do don't... not remember where that was. That's okay. I don't need it. What music is this? Oh, yeah. Um. This is a ghost house from some Mario game, I think. Or, no, this might be Bottle Grotto. I forget. Well, where are coming. you at anyway? Great Bay Temple? Great Bay Temple, Great Bay Temple. Yeah, mm, yeah. now I kind of want to go over there just to see if I can help you recognize the music. <laughs> you can always tune into my stream for a couple seconds. <laughs> I suppose so. Here, let me give that a shot. I've definitely heard it before. I can't tell if it's a ghost house theme or a bottle grotto or something else. Let me crack up and twitch for a moment, see if I can figure it out.
transmit. I almost feel like it would be faster to go to Great Bay Temple myself. <laughs> You could, you could, rabbit, you could. Oh boy. <laughs> Honestly, the stray fairies are great. They are not Lago Grotto. It, does it sound familiar to you, though? I've definitely heard it before. I've heard it just before too, but I think it was in a ROM hack. Also, I'm going to close the stream now because hearing myself, hearing echoes of myself speaking is driving my is driving me nuts. Yeah, that makes sense. But yeah, I, I know I've heard that before. I just think it was in a ROM hack, so I don't remember, so I don't recall the actual source. The whole um. Like, sounds really familiar. Yeah. Stop that. Just, just, just get out of the water. Uh, yeah, here's a frozen eyeball switch, for instance. I see one, yep. so... Can you melt those with sunbeams? I don't think you can. No, it has to be fire. Against, especially against, yeah, it's not in the right position for it anyway. Okay, don't don't just jump in the water, Link. I kind of want you to be on these ice platforms. Honestly, Great Bay Temple's really fast if you aren't going for uh, stray fairies. If you go in with the ice arrows. <laughs> and know exactly what to do. Also, did you um kill all of the Poe sisters in Akana Canyon? Uh, no, I think the only thing I... No, I didn't do that. That's right, I know what you're talking about now. That normally thing that normally gives you a piece of heart. Yeah. Yeah, but I definitely didn't do that. Alright, where's that bombable wall at? I don't remember, nor do I even recall if the emulator... Yeah, here it is. Okay, yes, the emulator does display that texture properly. That's good. Gimme. My sister's watching this while playing Splatoon 2. Thanks, Marty. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get sniped by splatter scopes while you're paying attention to us. Remember, rollers and the uh, blob blobber are the best. Even though they're not. Man, the the real bombachus are creepier than I remember. Yeah, they're, they're don't look too hard at their faces. Their eyes, man, their eyes are creepy. I do kind of like the sound they make though. The only rat I'm a fan of is the one in Ratatouille. Take, take this. Take oh, you Bobbits. I forgot you were flying around this room, and I hate you for it. A bat? <laughs> no, a bird. Stupid crow. Oh, guay. Guay. Yeah, I hate those things. Annoying little pests. And I forgot that I would kind of break my ankles if I jump down there. No kill like overkill, eh? <laughs> That's okay, I wasn't using those ankles anyway. <laughs> I just shot one of those Deku Babas with a light arrow, but it was so worth hmm. it. Because <laughs> with Chateau Romani, a light arrow is no more expensive than a regular arrow. Oh man. Oh wait, I can't remember. Does this have the small key or the compass? 
darn it, that was the compass. Alrighty, what's in here? Oh yeah, that's I thought the there was a cheap. Thought there was something for getting rid of those guys. I'll take this dumb butt. <laughs> I do not like the underwater punching controls. I don't recall that being a key, though. I think it was usually a stray fairy. That's right. I think the keys and the stray fairy chests might be swapped around among each other in the dungeon. No, no, they shouldn't be. That's right. We turned key randomization off, so right. I guess I'm just remembering wrong then. That, I guess it doesn't be in vanilla. That stray fairy is evil. Alright, well, speaking of Wart, I'm about to face him off in the... Or no, not Wart, this is Toad. Oh yes, the Jelly Toad. Yes. Oh, and I just realized we... Don Garrow's mask... Or no, no, Don Garrow's mask can't lead anywhere because you need to clear a snowhead before... Oh right. Yeah. Those Beemos only take one bomb to get rid of. No way. Isn't that nice? I do not like Beemos. Beemos are obnoxious. Oh, At least you can kill them. I do not like this boss. I do not like this boss because that can happen. I assume he's kicking. The, I assume he's beating the stuffing out of you right now. In the in the blob of lime jello, yes. Yes. Give me a hand here, Dexy hand. Hopefully, I can kill him in just another hit, though. I don't. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Take that. You're being a lame as me. Alright, boss key time. Okay, that's just straight fairy chest. No reason to even bother with it. This ch this this dungeon is deceiving, because there are only two keys, including the boss key. But you have to push all those switches. For the oh yeah, that's right. It uses, basically, switch gates instead of key gates. Yes. <laughs> exactly. Precisely. Oh, I love infinite Zora shield. Oh, I hate this stray fairy, though, in the pot at the very bottom of the current room. Oh, yeah. That pot is such a pain in the butt to punch. There we go. Shield is easier. Oh yes, this room. The room that fortunately, since we have light arrows already, we don't- I don't actually oh, have to I, do this room. I know exactly what room you're talking about. That annoying mirror. The room with all of the mirrors and the black uh -huh, bows everywhere uh -huh. constantly. That room's- Now I imagine the first room. time I did- if the first time I did this room, I did it with a keyboard. <laughs> you that poor, makes it even worse. Poor unfortunate soul. Alright, now I'm gonna fight Warden. Because he might have something. Yeah, I'm pretty sure these uh. Oh no, no bombs. I hope one. In I hope there's some bombs in there. Yeah, that's what I want to see. That's that's only five. That's all right. These guys. It's not very many. <sighs> Darn it! Where the? No, stop! I want to use three fairy sword, not bombs. I don't care if someone went live on YouTube. I can't watch them right now. Can't you see that I'm I'm busy streaming? No, you can't. They're like, oh, you're streaming to Twitch, though. We don't give a, a rip about that. We're going to interrupt you. Get away from me, you infinitely spawning black bows. <laughs> Who thought this was a good idea? I'm... Hey, I can't remember. This up. <laughs> I can't remember if this room has a chest, so I kind of have to check. Ah, uh, yes. So I have to check all these stupid suns. You know, no, I'm, I'm not going to do it. I'm just going to assume that there's no key here, and I'm just going to leave, because I don't want to deal with the black bows spawning on my face constantly. I'm safe. Right, C-Stick, not right down, C-Stick, please. Thank you. A couple stray fairies in here, but fortunately I don't have to worry about them, because I'm not dealing with that at the I moment. I his pudding eyes keep respawning. Stop throwing out bombs when I'm not inputting down on the C-Stick. You want it? It's yours, my friend. Even if you don't want it. That failed. Why 
do his, oh. little, why do his little jello eyes keep respawning? That feel when you accidentally miss the, uh, when you fail the current puzzle, so you're just like, mm, I'll dump in the lava, because that's Stop the easier way to get back to the start. Bombs! Oh, come on, how did that not just blind him? That's not what I meant to do. There we go. Finally, wards down on the ground. We're ready to be killed. Is this uh, this is Garrow Master, right? Yeah, this Die is Garrow Master. Ward is literally harder than like three out of the four main bosses in the game. <laughs> well, I have Gilded Sword now, so oh, Garrow Master yeah. should go down a lot faster. <laughs> Hot dog! I found the map to Snowhead. <laughs> would you care? Would you mind to back off a little bit, buddy? Oh boy! Oh wow! Yeah, Gilded Sword takes him out so much faster. I also have to keep an eye on time because I do still want to do the Angel Cafe side quest. Although I don't think there's really. Yeah, freeze, Octorok. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Light arrow turned into nothing spectacular, apparently. Piece of heart! Well, that puts me up to seven hearts, so that's not bad. Okie dokie, I can go soar back to the beginning. Now I just need to find the boss key and the, uh... Giant's mask, and the, uh, Giant's mask chest. Nice. Hello, Igor. As much fun Master. as it is to play with you, I'm not going to bother right now. The plans! Oh wait, we're all in the Igor. Well, it's fun to kind of run into the Igor and let him to uh, toss you around. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to bother with that right now. I'm just going to shoot him. Alright, time to reverse the current. Fairy. I'm still trying to figure out where I've heard this music before. Okay. Flip the temple. And that's right, now that it's upside down, we got Woodfall Temple music. <laughs> that's drastic change, Koopa's Road to Woodfall Temple. Yep. Alright. Now we get to the annoying part of the dungeon. Too far, Link. Oh, I did not expect that waterfall to push me. Climb up on the dang platform, thank you. Really? I'm getting pushed by the gear? Come on. What the heck? Stop glitching! Oh, I hate this. What the heck? I hate this! Knock it off! Having fun in, uh, Great Bay? Wow, that is the glitchiest fishbone I've ever seen in my life. 
He loves you. He wants to be your friend. Literally, he was swimming into the ice platform and was on top of it just to knock me down. Nice job doing a roll jump, Link. That's... No, he's doing it again. And I... When he's inside the ice platform, I can't climb on top of it. I also can't climb on top of it just to check. Please hook shot the Dane chest now. I don't even trust that. It's gonna melt before I can get a good grip. Stupid hip loop. No use for you. <laughs> I know, the exact hip loop that you're talking about. The one of the mask, right? Yeah. Mask hip loops. Yeah. Though you know that wasn't the only one, but you know, I know. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, please get on there. No. Oh, I freaking hate the fishbones so much. They're so freaking annoying. Alright, All right. that just drops right. that line of fire, which uh, doesn't even have a key in it, so I don't care. Here. Just right, and then... Oh, wait. <laughs> That's the wrong arrows! <laughs> I shot a fire arrow into a liquid waterfall, thinking that that would do mm -hmm. something. It, I say. It didn't. <laughs> Wasn't particularly effective, I say. No. Oh, hey, look, money dollars. Hey, Dexy Hand. Uh, wait, I'm already maxed on rupees. Never mind then. As you were. <laughs> I like money dollars. I don't know of any. But I already have dollars. the max of 99, so. Oh, that's right. You I don't, have, you don't have a giant's wallet. I haven't needed it yet, so. That is true. Well, the only thing you actually need the Giant's Wall for is whatever the All Night Mask was, and I believe it was 100 I think rupees. We confirmed it was, yeah, I think we confirmed it was, it was, it was useless. Junk. Yeah. Oh, yes, this room. That was a weird... I... Just get down in the hole and break the barrel. Just like that. I guess the ceiling lava room. This is the room you need fire arrows for. The seesaw room. I hope I don't run out of arrows. <laughs> dangerously low. At least the first quiver we found is the 40 quiver, <laughs> so. Oh, that's right. It's only the 40 quiver. I gotta change that on my tracker. Yeah, we never found the 50 quiver. In fact, I don't even think we have any guarantee that's... it's in the game. I forgot that if you hook shot the bomb chew, that it just pulls it towards you and doesn't kill it. Which yeah, is... that can be um, distressing. Just a tad. Yeah, block push puzzle room, and by push puzzle, I mean have fun shooting the flippy switch 600 times. Oh, one thing I... Oh, no, I did Also, not... don't stand on top of the pushable block and then flip the room. That uh, doesn't end well for you. No, it does not. Oh, wow, I might 100% clear the Great Bay Temple before I need to talk to Anju. That would be so great. At least we have fast pushing. Thank goodness the choo-choo didn't get on the platform. Then again, if Georg is annoying, that could be bad. May I help you? <laughs> Sir? No, I'm pretty good. Sir! Oh, I must ask how to kindly exit crevasses. That's what I'm looking for. I ask you to kindly and immediately exit the crevasses. Do that. Pop this one. Go! No. Pop this one. There we 
we go. All 15 straight fairies. Gonna fight a fish. Oh yes, hello, Wizro. And At least now I have a map and a compass, so you shouldn't be too hard to deal with. Shouldn't be. That being cute. <laughs> Alright, hey, Georg. What you up to today? I really wish I did have great, uh, fierce deity mask. That makes this fight a lot easier. I've never fought any of the other bosses with uh, with fierce deity mask except for Majora. Oh, really? Oh, because I've never played a randomizer, so I've never had access to it. Because oh. vanilla game only lets you use it, only lets you have it on the moon. Um, no. Once you get it and reset time, you have it, and you can use it on any of the boss fights. Never worked for me. Every time I would reset the game with the Majora's Mask in my inventory, it would delete it and give me all the Happy Masks back. Yeah, you get all of the Happy Masks back as well, but you also have your Steady Mask. Uh, I don't recall that happening. Okay, I recall so it when at that time, Majora's Fierce Steady's Mask was just gone. Don't know why that is, because I've never had that happen. How is this not damaging Georg? Georg is the glitchiest boss in the whole game. Like, without a doubt. Oh, he, oh he's definitely doubt. super... The way he's coded is super buggy, and you can totally see him completely and utterly fall apart. If you, like, use a levitate code, you can see that the way he's coded is just super bugged. Well, I've literally... I literally used the shield on his entire body, and it didn't hurt him, and then... He literally swam past me, did not touch me, and I got sucked somehow into his mouth. Yep, he, he's super buggy. Like, if you haven't seen my YouTube video where I, like, play around with the levitate code in his room, take a look at that. It, he does some really bizarre buggy stuff. Am I going to regret not getting double defense before Pior? Because I, I seriously might die to him. He's that glitchy. And like his his eat you attack, you literally can do nothing to stop it. Exactly. Like if you if it's just the way they hard coded it so that you can't get away from it. Like and if you use okay, the levitate code, we can confirm this. He will fly through the air to chase you down relentlessly. You cannot get away. Yeah. Take that, Georg, you glitchy boss. Oh, thank you for leaving me a single heart piece. Oh my gosh, and then his, his guppies left all these hearts as well. Well, sure, I'll take a piece of heart for a free refill. That sounds nice. <laughs> Won the horse race. Got 20 bucks. Alright, let's see what the Stray Fairy reward gives me. For your sake, I hope it's nothing. Stupid. Stupid flying armos can be really annoying. <laughs> yes, they can. Gath armos. They can be really annoying. There we go. Take that, Gue. That's right, you didn't actually have to guys. Oh, and now that I've cleared out Great Bay Temple, I could also do the fisherman's jumping game. I mean, that game's not particularly hard, but it can be a little annoying. It's, it's, it's annoying, that's it. Do, do, do. You got a spiritual stone, I mean a small key. Fairy Fountain, what you gonna give me? You're gonna give me... Oh, the Razor Sword. That's interesting. Well, I mean, there you have it. <laughs> I have a better sword. I, I'm happy with that. I mean, like, 
until you get a hundred rupees. Or until you get the, uh, the Camaro until you use a hundred times or get the Camaro mask or whatever. Alright. Now let's set up the meeting with Anju. Alright, that's just another small K. Or stray fairy. Yes, Igor, you just have fun up there. I'll get to you eventually. Oh yeah, neither of us ever did the Goron Treasure Shop game. Oh yeah, we Cause, didn't. Because it closed by the time I wanted to do it. And I just forgot about it. <laughs> yep. Hey, <laughs> hey girl. <laughs> okay, I don't like this game. Look oh, at my it's, big, it's beefy a, body. It's a gilded chest. It, it, it could be good. I mean, this, this do you mind? So hey, random. Oh wow, that was, it was almost a straight shot. It has... The Bunny Hood! Hey, that would have been nice to have earlier. Oh, that was a great thing to do. <laughs> okay, Gomez, let's go. Oh, Gomez is my all-time favorite Zelda miniboss. Mm, I mean, he has, he's... The, he has the coolest design. He's like a vampire meets the Grim Reaper. He's the best of both worlds. Ready yet? So now, made a calculated decision. I'm gonna go back to Great Bay. I'm gonna do Fisherman's Game, and then if that turns up nothing, I'm gonna do Ocean Sculpture House. I don't like the Fisherman's Game because the camera is often really annoying. Also, he's like always on break. Okay, Gomez is scratched. Now get the boss key. Because the shield kind of cheeses him. The shield? Yep. Just like you know how he counter yeah, he just kind of counterattacks every time you hit him, just put up your shield. Every time you hit him he does that spinny oh, yeah. the, the rage thing, and just yeah. starts charging towards you, and you just put up your shield. Yeah. He'll clink off your shield. Hold on, I I the freaking hate how the fishermen's always like, oh I'm not running the game now. I'm on break. Catch me another time. When I go there, fine. I'm just because I'm a lazy, because I'm a lazy fat sack of fat. <laughs> Not just a sack of fat. He's a fat sack of fat. That's how fat he is. All right, I'm off. I'm gonna do Ocean Sculptula then. I'm gonna. Ooh, it has the fairy thing. Uh, That's nice. Warp back to the start of the dungeon because I don't see any reason to be here at this angle. There are two chests. There are two things I'm getting. I also believe I remember where all the tokens are. Oh, I didn't slide into that? Now I did. Cool. Whatever, let's just go back this way. Weird how the gold sculptures and the tokens they drop have different sized hitboxes. Hmm, yeah. Let's see, right, I have to get up to that little section of the dungeon now. I'm just trying to recall how I have to do that. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. 
how to actually get to the boss room. I'm trying to remember how to do that. <laughs> Alright, first things first. I'm gonna talk to all the Stal kids and get the code. Yeah, no, Poe, I don't have time to deal with you. I mean, I do have time to deal with you, I just don't want to. <laughs> Not wrong, that was... Get out of here. I accidentally tapped the D-pad and was changing forms instead of doing a spin attack. Oh, bother. Like, this is not what I asked to, or want for or wanted to do. Alright, green, something, 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 red. Green, green, er, sorry, I'm new at this. I mean, blue, blue. <laughs> Oh yeah, I hope they have arrows in here. Good. <laughs> I think I can just soar back to the entrance. I honestly don't... Green, blue, something red, something red. Okay. How did I get to the bus room? Green, blue, green, red, something red. Alrighty. Green, blue, green, red, yellow, red. Let's see, that's just the Gomez section. Don't glitch into the chimney, Link. Just go up here. Uh, well, it's not gonna have the whole lie. It's not gilded. Do you have to flip it back oh, up boy, to right? Oh boy, bomb shoes! Do you have to flip the temple back upright to get to the boss room? Nope, it's upside down. I do not remember how to get there at all. So you have to go all the way around. Where. So it's it's pretty close to the Gomez room. Uh, in the Deku Flower area, there should be a branching path that you can take that leads to back to the beginning, but on a different side. accidentally kill the style children while we're trying to kill the Skulchulas. Thank goodness I don't have to do the pushing puzzle again. Sir. Zora mask, climb up here. There we go. Wizro broom. Go down here. Room with the pose. Let's see, there ain't nothing here in the room with the pose, I don't think. Wait. Oh no, wait, you can climb up you can climb up here and go up the staircase, can't you? Yeah, you can. Or that leads to a small key. Uh, no you can't, actually. I mean, like, if you try to go to this section, like, it literally is just an invisible wall. Okay. Great. Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't know what part you're at, then. The room with the pose. It looks like there's a... It's the upside-down version of the room that has all of the, uh, like, all of the floor switches near the start of the dungeon. Oh, yeah, you can go up there. Yeah, but, like, there's a little passage there that looks like it should lead to a staircase, but instead it's just an invisible wall. Oh. There's this section here with the death armos, but that doesn't lead anywhere. That just 
the, the, the floor switch to make the fairy appear, fairy chest appear. Then there's uh. Clear out the mines. I must be missing something really, really obvious, but I'm just. There's something right blind. next to where you can go up the staircase, and it should. Uh, to the switch area, and you, it should take you to the first room. And there's a switch there that makes a chest appear upside down, and then you hookshot the chest to reach the area. For the right! Place. That's it! You have to hookshot that chest! I always forget that part. You have to hookshot that chest to get to the next section. I like the hookshotting upside down chests. It's fun. Like, yeah, but I just totally forget about that part because it's yeah. just so inconspicuous and you'd never think to do it. There's so many skull chills. It's not this chest. This chest just dumps you in a hole. Right, the game has you actually Z target it. Yeah. The game. The game actually puts a Z target there to give you a hint because that's actually um. That's a trick. But you won't game. notice it unless you actually look up there. But yeah, that is the hardest part of the dungeon, hands down. Mirror puzzle. Well, that part doesn't count because that's not. It's not really hard. That part's just obnoxious. My fire my light. And this is normally the giant mass chest, I think. Yeah, it is. It's a piece of heart. Okay, Stone Tower Temple doesn't have anything of particular use inside of it. Well, Twin Mold might drop something. Uh, okay, that's a spiky log. Try this again with less bashing our face into hearty, pointy objects. Yeah, that's not good. Do the hook shot upside down the chest thing again because now it's more conspicuous because the game's already told you about it. I, lo I love the library room in the sculpture house. There's so many secrets. Okay, this is going to be a tough boss fight because I've never done this before without yeah, Giant's Map. It's interesting. We also don't have fire arrows. Oh, that's right, you didn't pick up fire arrows. Because we haven't found them yet, have we? Yes, I did. You did? Where? I told you that you have to do target practicing with Romani. Oh, that's that's really bad. Is it no longer first day for you? Well, of course it's not first day for me. Also, I'm in the boss room, so... Oh yeah, because now you can't even check all the stray fairies. Discord must have cut me out when I told you. Alright. There we go, all the ocean sculptures. Let's blow this popsicle stand. Uh, so what are you supposed to do if you run out of arrows here? I think you just lose. I think you might just lose. So, life hack, don't run out of arrows. This is horrific. Because their hitboxes are way smaller than it appears, and they are moving so fast. Okay, um, reward for beating the Ocean Sculptural House on the first day or first night is the Fierce Deities Mask. Okay, I'm doing that, because I am absolutely refused to fight this boss without it, because this that's horrific. It's this bad. boss is absolute nightmare without it, without the giant's mask. That is unplayably bad. 
Yeah, it's pretty awful. Alright. I'm gonna see if the fisherman's operating his stupid game now. And did you say I have to beat it on the first day? First day or okay. first night. Or first night. Uh, well, I've only don't have a lot of time left in the cycle, so we're resetting. What? Were you on the final day? Uh, I'm on the... It's 8 p.m. on the first day. Oh, you've got plenty of time. Nah, too late. Reset. Okay. <laughs> Erase all your progress in the Stone Tower Temple already. Um, it won't be that hard to get back through it. Oh, it does erase all your progress in the ta in the dungeon, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay. Well, maybe I should just. You can be okay. you can beat the guess... house before time runs it. Uh, before the second day. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna have to freaking speed run it. It's not too bad. <laughs> it's gonna be tight. <laughs> all right, you stupid fisherman. Let's see what your game is. Let's see what the reward is. Oh, that is evil. He literally put out the torch as I reached the platform. That's because he hates you. Literally. Like the instant I was about to touch the ground, he's like, nope, puts out the fire. <laughs> oh, you don't get a point. It's like when you play your last card in Uno, <laughs> only for someone to point out that you didn't save Uno. Yep. What's extra fun is when you can get away with that. <laughs> yep. Hey, Fisherman, are you gonna make me, like, ever to jump to any other platform other than these two? There we go. Sometimes you just have to ask politely. Or impolitely. Oceanside Spider House. Okay, we are speedrunning, boys. There are three in the first room. Right, first you have to bomb the wall. Da do de 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 do. Honestly, the fisherman's game could be kind of fun in real life. Well, that'd also be a good workout. Right. You gotta... You gotta burn that spider web, don't you? Which means yeah. you need the fire arrows to get through this place. Oh, actually, yeah, you do need fire arrows to get through it. There's one cobweb that you need to burn. <sighs> Which means I need to reset the cycle, do Romani, and then I need to redo the entire Stone Tower Temple. Apparently. Wow, what a rip Everything off. I've done so far has been a complete and utter waste. Good! Well, no, you found out that there was nothing important in, uh... The... Or I guess the Giant's Mask chest is barely out of the way at all. Aha! No, I don't need fire arrows! Tech with you, I use the torch to light my arrow and no, then use I'm, that! I'm just gonna warn you ahead of time, there's one cobweb on the ceiling that you need fire arrows, and there's a sculpture behind it. What room is this in? It's in the very bottom most room. Is it in the entrance room or in the basement? It's in the basement. As far down in the basement as you can go and as far down the hallway in the basement as you can get. Great Bay Temple as well, if you wanted to catch up.
Yep, and there's no fire source in this room. Yep. Sorry, bro. <sighs> Kill me. I think I think you might have to just reset the whole cycle now. Yep. There's no other solution. Because Twin Mold is completely unfightable without Giant's Mask or Fierce Deity's Mask. Like, I mean, it's technically doable, but you don't it would go take that. it would take so many save states and so much pain and effort to go through. It's not worth it. All right. Like, because I don't have emulator slowdowns to use either. That's true. You do have save states, but I guess that doesn't help a whole lot. That only helps somewhat. Because yeah, these things move so fast. You don't realize how fast they're moving because you never do this in vanilla. Well, and also, I think one they get faster once they're low on HP. Yeah, there's that too. But even when, fortress. but even like, even at the very start of the fight, they're just so immensely fast. Yeah, they're pretty fast. Okay, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. Anyway. I'm gonna save state hack my way through this. Okie dokie. Have fun. Fun, right? <laughs> I'm gonna go get Cafe's letter. We go. Well, I've got three hits so far. Excuse me? Oh, one other thing I can check is the uh, Kyaume archery game after clearing the swamp. So I guess I'm fighting the Dala again. Because neither of us checked that. Gotcha. And again. Yes, thank you for spawning out of the floor underneath me. That's very helpful. Wow, the cooldown on light arrows is so bad. Especially when the game lags. Oh, yeah, and I have Fristidi's mask now, and I think I can wear it anywhere. That's right. Oh, so Odalus can literally die in three seconds then. Gonna have to edit that out of the YouTube video. Thought I was cursing cost silently enough that the mic wouldn't pick it up. Oh, it did. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> Alright, Odala. <laughs> you like sword beams? Thank god, why am I doing this to myself? <laughs> Goodbye, Odala. <I> wonder... <laughs> wonder who designed this boss fight and thought it was okay. It's... It... Not, they're not as badly designed as Georg, but it's close. They're just not that fun. Okay, red one's dead. Nice. Snowhead's gonna be the last dungeon we do. Yep. <laughs> Unless we deliberately save one of the other dungeons for last. Right, you can't hit them in the head. Why would you want to hit them in the head? I think you. I thought you could hit them in it. I thought you could hit them in the head or the tail. Uh, well, you can't hit them in the head with arrows. Oh, it's kind of impractical. <laughs> no, I mean I've like literally shot them in the face and it didn't do anything. Oh, just okay. taint. Never mind. <laughs> You can hit them in the head when you're Giant's Mask, yes. Did but... you ever did you ever save Pamela's father in Econa Canyon? Uh, I don't think I did, no, because I didn't have Song of Healing at the time. Okay. That's another don't thing I, I still think I don't. Hmm. 
Where did I find that? I guess we can look up in the spoiler. Oh, yeah, that's right. I still have to save... Kaume! Oh, um, I forget where red potions are. This is this has got to be a good hit. This is a good setup for a hit. Do you remember where any red potions are? Uh, I don't think I ever found a red potion. Oh, I Did remember. I? I remember. There's a red potion on the chest on the third day tower. Well, okay. So I can't I can't do Kamei archery until the final day. And then the the other one was honey and darling all three days. I remember now. Bunny hood. All right, I think it's okay. Not... There we go. Nice job. Oh, I'll also do the uh, pose. A piece of heart became a piece of heart. The heart container became a piece of heart. Yeah, heart container became a piece of heart. The, the, the giant's man or the mask reward turned into twenty dollars. So yeah, that was super stupid and awful. But I really hope the Gornwall is not behind stray fairies in Gritstone Tower. Yeah, there's nothing there. Um, right. I suppose I could try checking. Uh, um, the post sisters. Did you take the post sisters I'm out? I'm doing them right now. Oh well. In that case, I'm not gonna bother. <laughs> Get out oh, of my way, I, I forgot to Go. equip deep nuts. Did we check if Tingle here is selling anything? I'm not sure. Oh no, I have, I have not checked what the stone tower map is for Tingle. Yeah, neither did I. Even though you can buy it in Great Bay. Okay, stupid Poe sisters. And they're double team. Take that. Just hit me, and I'll jump attack you. You're dead. Now we can do... May I help you? <laughs> Hang on. I never got my happy burgers. Um... So much. I gotta love how the game gives you literally one second to pick up the 50 rupees. Mom calling about shopping. Uh, well, post, post sisters just had twenty bucks, so nothing important. Okay. I well. literally paid more to fight them than I got. Okay, Tingle's not selling anything except for milk, which I mean <laughs> might be necessary for the well. You can also play a pony song to any cow. Think, do we have Gibdo's mask? I do. Where is it? Um, where was it? Like, isn't, isn't there, like, at least something in the well? Okay, Gibdo's Mask, I think I got that for the dog race, for betting 50 rupees and winning. 
Okay, well, I do have Mask of Truth, okay. so I can do that. Pa Pamela's father, uh, he got healed, and he gave me uh, Gorman's Mask. <laughs> okay, so honestly, what I'm seeing here is a reset cycle. P probably. I'm going to check out... Did you... Oh, that's right, because I have the fire arrows, I can complete the Ancient Castle of the Kana stuff. Oh, yeah, I'm going to go do that. <laughs> yeah, I've got time. I can take on the, uh... I can save the barn later. Oh, crap! I forgot about the redeads. No, it's okay get redeads. It's cool, I'm one of you. Dance for me. Which means I need to remember where the powder keg is. Powder keg is sold at the Goron shop. Right. See, I can't remember what all is in the bottom of the well and what all we're going to need. I still don't know what's beneath the well. I know the first two Gibdos at the entrance, one of them wants a bunch of magic beans and the other one wants blue potion. Hmm. Blue potion you can find, like, underneath the pirate's fortress in the Goron area. Yeah. And then there's, um... Like, I think there's at least one piece of heart in there. There's a couple of chests in beneath the well. There's the one with the mirror shield, and then there's a couple of others. Yeah, I wonder if, uh... It might be better to go grab the fire arrows first. Because you just have to do the practice with Romani, yeah, which I still do on day one. ASAP. Oh, wait a um, second. Oh my gosh, I have Fierce Deities maps. This will make the fight against Ego Sakana and his guards even easier. Right, because we can use that anywhere. Yeah. Oh man, I want to get that mask so I can play around with it. Damn it. Um, but I can't remember where it is because I already forgot. It's Skultola House. But you need fire arrows first, which means I need to go get rupees, and which means I need to go and do this and that and the other thing. Ugh. I'm on the back foot again. The only thing we need left to beat the game is going around Zalalabai, yeah? Yep. Uh, I hate it when the guards die so far away from the light beams. Come get me, bro. Come get me. Okay, let's see. Goron Shop. <laughs> there we go. Alright, Ego Sakana. Come at me. Honestly, Ego Sakana should have been the real boss of Stone Tower Temple, not uh, Twin Mold. Twin Mold. Hate Twin Mold. Or Gomez. I would have loved Gomez as the main boss if he made, they made him a bit tougher. Yeah, because I mean, Don't he right now he's He just died too shame. far away from the stupid Light Beam. Why are both of the Light Beams as, as far away from the windows as possible? <laughs> Okay, I still don't really have the milk. I have never. Back. What the I heck? I have never seen Ego Sakana do that. He literally, he literally gave me the kiss of death. Oh, where he like snaps his head off and then chomps it on your head to hold, and then chomps you to hold you in place while his body hits you. Yeah. But he does that in every single fight with me, so I'm very Are surprised you... that you've never seen he it. He keeps dying as far away from the light as possible. Can I just shoot a light arrow at him, please? I'm literally about to die because he won't get anywhere near the light beams, and he. This is so annoying. Yeah, I've literally never seen him do the kiss of death before. I've literally never, never seen him not do it, so I'm very surprised you haven't heard of it. Oh god, you 
cornered now. I've got you cornered now. Never mind, he teleported magically and killed me. Because apparently that's a thing that he can do. I'm sorry. So we're both wow, suffering. it puts me all the way back at the beginning of the dungeon. Wow. Okay, so well, like if he's gonna suffering. break out a bunch of moves that he's never done before, then sure, of course I could win. A piece of heart for 20. You know what? I'll take it, because I'm here. <laughs> and I have if, the money. if you've got the cash, why not? Don't give me one more will put me hearts. up hearts, so. Thanks for the one heart. That was really great. All right. Forget Fierce Didi Mask. I'm getting, I'm getting the uh, Great Fairy ma uh, Sword. Do 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 do. Well, wasn't expecting that music. I, I love Prince. I don't know Castle. how they were able to melt my hearts that quickly. Did I like enter in with only four hearts or something? Do 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 do. do. Wait a second, if I equip the stone mask, will they ignore me? Okay, that first fight went a lot better. Now let's see what Egos does. Let's push him towards the light beam this time. <laughs> I'm gonna see if the stone mask work on him. Oh my gosh, stone mask worked on him. Goodbye. <laughs> He loses track of you if you use stone mask. Yep. Oh, he just gave me bomb shoes. Wow. Disappointing. Okay. I've just got to see what the heart piece on the pillar turned into. Fire arrows, thank you. Yes, please refill my HP. I appreciate that. Took on the mirror of nighttime as a blah blah blah, I'm not doing that. I still don't know if I'm even doing this puzzle properly. Oh hey, fifth place for not moving. Nice. Because this seems like a very hackish way to do the puzzle, to like use the Deku flower to push the ceiling back up. I think that's what you're intended to do. Really? Because it seems like that it's is... a very hackish way because like half the time it doesn't even work. I remember seeing a strategy guide that literally suggested that was the way to do it, so I'm okay. pretty sure that's the intended way. Oh yeah, now I have to navigate this room without the lens of truth. I got fire arrows, so now it. we want to go get Fierce Duty's mask. Gotcha. I, I don't think I'll need the Lens of Truth. Oh, at last the Ancient Castle of Akana music came on. Mako, shut your face! I'm just gonna leave you to drown, okay? Got it? Got it? Got it, good. Just give me the water? No! No! You're not getting to shore. You're, you're gonna stay there. And you're gonna shut your face. Leave me alone. All right, what's what's on the pillar in the castle? Yeah, normally that piece of heart is pretty tricky to get. On the castle? Yeah. Let's see what it is. It is... Oh, it's 20 bucks. Never mind. 
not worth it. Let's see, I got bombs, I've got a... A handful of arrows, I got fire arrows, we're good. We can get everything in here now. I'm a little late to my rendezvous with Anju, but she'll stay there for the whole night. So. Do 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 mail here, Kachin. Letter has been received, Kachin. Deposit your butt here, Kachin. It did not tell me to do that. Oh, that's right. <laughs> I have to do the sneak pe I have to do the sneaky way into the stock pocket. <laughs> Then after this, I really should save the ranch. All right, we kind of need to check if saving the ranch gives anything. Yeah. And of course, and there's you. the. Uh... And of course, that also lets you meet up with a. Uh... What's her face? <laughs> oh my gosh, Andrew! <laughs> Andrew gave me bombs, <laughs> and she told me to put them in the mailbox. <laughs> What is wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> secretly a terrorist. Not so secretly. She gave it. Actually, I guess we were the only people at the end, but wow. <laughs> All right. Gotta stop the alien invasion. What kind of terrorist are you? A terrifying terrorist. <laughs> is that the lot of my voice? You, check, you checked the, um, the Stout Children password, and it didn't give you anything interesting, uh, right? No, no, it was junk. I want to say it was just bomb shoes. Let's see. I hate the spiders crawling around in the those little borderline ceiling gaps in the flippity gibbet. Those stupid skulltolas are the worst. Oh, yes. I wonder. Um, do you need to shoot the, the aliens with the bow, or can you hit them with the sword? Uh, I'm... I've never tried hitting them with the sword, mainly I'm gonna, because I'm gonna usually just test high off Fierce ground. Deity's mask out on them and see what that does. That would be kind of interesting, actually. I would assume that they'd, they'd probably pop if you hit them with anything. Also, but... I love how massive Fierce Deity is. Epona, you can leave. You're not trapped here. Game says you haven't done the Epona Son sequence. I'm stuck. I can't get out. Okay, no, it, no, it, it, ha anyway. it has to be arrows. Ah, uh, they're immune to everything else. Yeah. It's the one. It's the one that comes behind the barn. That's the sneaky one. Let's see, all oh, right, the pushable bookcase. And to think, I used to find the aliens hard to deal with. Well, they are kind of hard if you don't have a uh... a map. Yeah, if you don't have the map, and also if you're using a keyboard, that makes it a little harder, too. True enough. I'll never have a more legendary save than that time I completely forgot about them. Came in at, like, 3 o'clock in the morning. Just shoot the guy. Come on. That was a glorious highlight. Okay, I accidentally, um, nuked that Gold Skulltola with a, um, fire arrow, which was kind of unnecessary overkill, but whatever. <laughs> he deserved it. He did. He's between me and the Fierce Deity's mask. He needs to die. Keep in mind the random guy who's just like, I want to buy this place. Here, I'll give you this mask of the gods. That sounds like a good deal. Default Halion music is honestly the best. It has such that other worldly feel to it. Black bow and a vase, get out of here! I don't need this from you. Alright, that's that'll I think that'll do it. That should do it. They die. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Saving the ranch gave me the da -da 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 sound. That's great. All right. Oh, yeah, I have Circus Leader's Mask. Forgot to mark that. And Romani's Fang, she gives me 20 bucks. Gee, thanks. And now, having Gee, said babe. that, her sister might give me something for helping her out later. I thought I remembered one of them being under a vase. Dawn of the second day. 48 hours remain. <laughs> Shouldn't have poked your head out. It's a good way to lose it. Alright, I'm gonna eventually go into the well today, and I'm gonna try to have as much of the stuff that I need as possible. That's right, I guess we should deal with the well, shouldn't we? Yeah, probably. I don't know if we need to talk to Creamy in order to go on the carriage ride with her, but I'm going to just in case. No, I don't think you need to talk to her. At... Oh well, I did it anyways, because I wanted to meet her. Alright, I think the main thing I need to buy before going... Actually, no, I don't even need the magic beans, I'm just going to go guns blazing in. But I'm gonna go in from the ancient castle of Akana. So start. Oh yeah, backdoor it. Yeah, backdoor it. <laughs> gonna pre-equip the Gibdos mask just in case. All right, you little destroyer of hopes and worlds, get over here. Crush my hopes and dreams. I'll crush your. Little spidery face. You tell that, Sculptula. I'm just checking. To, okay, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, I'm just checking to make sure I actually did get, did not get the Goron's Zolbi, and I just didn't just forget about it. I, yeah, I don't We're still missing it, huh? We are still missing it. Yeah. It's the one thing between us and the end of the game, so. Yeah, quite literally. There he is. Let's see okay, what's in the let's might... see what's in the mirror shield chest. Right, I didn't I couldn't get that because I didn't have fire arrows. Or Deku sticks slash the Gibdo mask. It's a gilded chest. Could be. It's the lens of truth. Interesting. Mm. Oh, I know what to do now. Actually, I'm gonna keep going for the well, but with the lens of truth, we can heal Darmani. And get access oh. to hot spring water, which opens up quite a few checks in the Goron village area. That's true. Howdy, boys. Yep, don't that's don't mind me. Funny, just... That's quite a funny sound effect for when a wall master appears. What sound effect did you get? <laughs> I think it's the sound that Dampe makes when he sees the big Poe is approaching. Do 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 do. All right. I think this guy wants a bug, if I'm not mistaken. Boom. He wants a bug. Give me something creepy, give me something crawly. Give me something small and creepy. Ah, uh, yes, yes. This is one of the rooms with the chests. I have a feeling it's... I have a feeling Goron Lullaby is going to be the Anju and Cafe side quest. Hmm. That, or it's going to be a miscellaneous chest that we need hot spring water for in Snowhead. Oh, I, found a, I found a piece of heart in the well. For those watching in Twitch and YouTube land, I don't have the entire map of the well memorized exactly where all the checks are, so bear with me. This is the part of the... This and the Moon Trials are the parts of the game I am least familiar with. Hey bro, what do you want? Really, you have to burn both of these cobwebs? Oh, what? Who's... I... What clever 
Smart Alex idea was it to put two cobwebs in front of the hole. Someone who got a big raise. Bad. Big raised set of underwear because somebody gave him a wedgie. <laughs> nice spin. Alright. Well, thank goodness I got the blue potion before coming here. Where are those last two spitters? Here you go, bro. A blue potion just for you. Happy birthday, Jesse Bear. Alright. I'm gonna pick up the fish, because I have a feeling I'm gonna need it. Uh -huh. Who here wants a fish? You want the fish. I knew he wanted the fish. Where's that last spitter? Boy, here's the hot spring. Ah, there it is. In that phase. Oh wait, I just realized, with fire arrows, we didn't even need the hot spring water. We literally had access to melt the ice anyways. Wow, I'm still... Oh. Derp. I'm still gonna pick up hot spring water, though, because uh, one of the uh, Gibdos wants it. Okay, first duty's mask is collect. Nice job. Okay, now where do I go next? <laughs> oh, <laughs> he just wants regular water, not hot water. Wow. <laughs> You know what? Forget the well. Forget the well. I'm going to Snowhead. I'm going to Mountain Village. Um, yeah, so... Where should I go next? I mean, I guess I could go into Great Bay Temple and clear it out, because we're gonna need to beat it anyway. Oh, wait. Hang on, before I go to Mountain Village... Actually, no, no. I'll, I'll stay at Mountain Village for now. I should have played... I should have learned Scarecrow Song first, though. <laughs> Eventually, I should get to a point where I can climb up to Darani's grave without the lens of truth, but I am not at that point yet. Oh, yeah, I'm so bad at whistling. No, that the, the Caribbean Bay, Great Bay theme does not fit Mountain Village. Right, that's where it is. <laughs> My hot spring water cooled, that's okay. <laughs> oh wow, the Goron Graveyard is playing the Great Fairy Fountain music. Uh, while I'm here, I'm going to look up where the Stone of Healing is, because I genuinely don't remember. Right, Kokiri music, Kokiri forest music in here. Oh, the Psalm of Healing is in the Gerudo Fortress, and where the hookshot usually is. That's easy enough to get. I thought that's where the Garrow's mask was. Oh, I mean, boy. that's okay, but do we actually need it? Um, I didn't know if Darmani was going to give us something. He did not. He just gave me twenty dollars to let him go to heaven. Good for him. <laughs> he got to heaven for twenty bucks. Okay, right. New wave right. must come. How did I go? Left, up, left, right, down, left, right. All right. Two more things I can check with: fire arrows and the snowhead area. What the heck? What's old man Goron doing? Frozen. You can't get anything. That's how it goes. Mm -hmm. 
Okie dokie. Get in here? No, it's not gonna be in this chest. Piece of heart? 20 bucks. Alrighty. Well. Okay, did we get all the great fairies in here and confirm whether there was anything here? Uh, where are you? Great Bay Temple. Great Bay Temple, uh, Stray Fairies led to the Razor Sword. So no, it's not worth Okay, it. so literally worthless. For you, co completely worthless. Alright, I'm gonna... I'm gonna do the powder keg training to blow up the Gohan Race entrance. Though we've at least 100% confirmed there's nothing but garbage in there. Because there better we, not be anything there, because I specifically ticked the box. Force said it to be garbage. Enforced junk location. Howdy, bro. What's up? Sure, I'll give it a try. I should have bought another powder keg from the bomb shop, blown it up before coming here, because if you use a different powder keg to blow up the racetrack entrance, you can literally just immediately detonate the one they give you, and then they're like, oh, you did it! <laughs> oh. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I should have... I should have gotten a powder keg before coming here, as well as Scarecrow Soul. Spiders. Okay, let's see here. They could break into this section of the dungeon early because I already have the ice arrows. Just make sure you activate all the pipes along the way. I think I know what you're talking about though. Don't don't reverse the current until you've used the activated all the switches. Oh I just thought well, of, I, can I just thought can... of another place it could have been. We might need to get um Goran Lullaby from the Smithies. Oh yeah. That's that's and, an interesting And I I even know where the gold dust is. There we go. Goran racetrack is blown up. What was that sound? That was the sound of me hitting the pole as a Goron and spitting as a result. Okay, I can immediately get the green pipe going. What, what you gonna give me? I just did your dirty work for you. What you gonna give me? A hundred bucks! Okay, that's not terrible, but also not what I wanted. Alright, new plan. Well, I'm gonna get the gold dust and give it to the smithy. Oh, another thing I should do. I have the bunny hood, so I can do the postman's game as well. Right, because it becomes feasible to do that with the bunny hood. Yes. Except I, don't, I never know what times... Postman's open, because that it changes depending on whether you do the Anju and Cafe side quest or not. Oh wait, no. No, I don't want to warp. I want to go to the bomber's hideout. Thankfully, I wrote the code down, so I don't have to remember it. Using Fierce Didi's mask just to make a jump. 
use merit for that. I like using bunny hood to make jumps work. I assume that nothing's going wrong if I'm hitting these switches out of order. <laughs> no, no. You can hit the switches. Yes, I mean, order. they would have thought of that. Because, I mean, they would have thought about that because uh, you can always just replay the dungeon again and hit them out of order. Exactly. Yeah, so. That shouldn't be a problem. Hello, old man. I would like to look at your telescope. So that way the dumb Deku will appear in his burrow. I discovered something interesting, all right. I don't think I can escape from here without a magic bean, so... Oh, wait. Oh, wait, no. I was about to wait, I think there's a Deku flower. No, <laughs> if there's a Deku flower, you could escape as Deku Link in the prologue. If the Goron Lullaby is hidden here, that would be very ironic. Oh no, it's just a heart piece. Never mind. I can see it from here. I was wondering if it was on the Scarecrow platform in uh, Path to Snowhead. Missing three masks at this point. He's angry. <laughs> angry. Your gold dust. You enjoy that. At this point, I think I can just speed up time and go to Cafe's house. Actually, I think I can go to Cafe's house at any time. So... Oh, one thing I need to remember to get is the pendant. Can't forget about that pendant. I wonder if it would be behind the Don Garros side quest. I can't, because you need to enter Snowhead and beat it before you can. Oh that right, side quest. because yeah, right. 
I thought about that. <laughs> Give me the pendant. I can't remember what the Bosque. cutoff time to meet Cafe is. I'm not gonna risk it. I'm just gonna play it the way I always do. Can't remember the cutoff time to meet Coffee. <laughs> I can't remember the cutoff time for when it's acceptable to drink coffee. Oh, hey, look, shell blades. Uh, what are shell blades? Are they the fishbone the enemies? Shell blades? No, they are the clam enemies, and oh, they're yeah. super duper de and they're super duper dead because they'll <laughs> obliterate them, which is excellent. Uh, I'll hail the mighty magic shield of the Zora. All right. Yo, Mr. Real. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. That was that was wonderful. Alright, I'm just gonna hang out here till Cafe allows me into his house. Alright, that's where the red switch starts. Yeah, okay, fine, I'll go do it. here in day two clock town. Okay, this time please do what I asked you to do. Oh, Climb up wait, hang on. You. While I wait, I know what I actually should be doing. <laughs> Since I have oh. literally nothing better to do, I'm gonna go get double defense. That's a pro I could also, if I wanted to, just scale Stone Tower and get the Owl Statue, because I don't have that yet, but... Nah. Right, this just leads to Wart. There's kind of no reason to kill Wart, is there? No, no, Wart had nothing. Just enter the secret shrine. Oh, and I think uh, Fierce Deity Mask might make Wart a little bit easier. I mean, yeah. Actually, come to think of it, that just seems like some interesting th catharsis, so I'm gonna go try that. <laughs> I'm gonna try him on secret, Wart. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy, guess what I got? Oh. Uh, never mind, the sword beams don't actually work on... The sword beams don't actually work to, uh, knock the bubbles off. Oh, uh, well, you can still use spin attacks, and he should be high enough that you can reach Wart when his eyes open. Ultimate strategy, flail around like a madman till he dies. My strategy is literally just spin attack him over and over again. Give me that double defense. Give it to Snowhead me. map. <laughs> ah, yeah. Oh, and beautiful. Oh, it's, it's still only 2 o'clock. <laughs> Was that worth losing half of my life over? Probably not, but whatever. <laughs> Some sweet, Just cut sweet some phases open and it's back. 
I just cut oh some vases gosh. and then I got it back, so... Because my like, hearts were white and now they've got the white border, it's like a blinding light. <laughs> looking at my HP now. <laughs> Alright, back to cafe. <laughs> back to the cafe. I'm gonna intimidate Cafe just by standing outside as Fierce DD Link. <laughs> yeah! Hi, okay. my man! Yeah! <laughs> I'm currently on the job. <laughs> Open up, Cafe! There's definitely not a Nephilim with a giant helix sword outside to meet you. It's locked. I'm big enough to break the door down. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm literally twice his height. <sighs> oh wow. Chunky. Fierce DD Link actually could open the door. That's rare. It's impressive. Usually he can't open doors because he's too chunk. Because <laughs> he, he's a chunky boy. And also like literally eight feet tall. <laughs> Fat lardy boy. Yep, he's still on my pillow. <laughs> what is your cat named? Fat Marty? Fat lardy boy. Fat lardy boy. Is that his official name or just a nickname? No, uh, <laughs> he has about six million nicknames, all of, most of which revolve around him being fat. That sounds like my old cat. He was the best cat ever. Chunky blubber butt. <laughs> Chunky, cat Chunky cats are the cat best. Captain Waddlebottom. <laughs> okay, where am I supposed to go next? I don't remember how to get to the boss room. Tempted to just grab the levitate code and fly to the <laughs> boss room. This dungeon is long and I don't want to do it. It's not that long if you're not looking for stray fairies. Oh boy, Cafe, thanks for giving me the map to Great Bay! <laughs> now I won't get lost there, even though I've literally done everything in Great Bay. I, th I think I've literally done everything in Great Bay. Don't remember how to get through this place. Something tells me I'll have to choose between the Mailman's game and Creamia's ride. At this point, I think I actually have to uh, reverse the current. Here's your pendant, Andrew. So happy. Maybe the mailman. Maybe the mailman will get home before. Uh, the clock strikes six. There he is! Yeah, he's gonna get home by five. Now the question is, will he let me in his room? Yes, he will. Yes, and he's doing the training. Cool. <laughs> ah! Don't disrupt my training! Pierce, I'm not the only person who refuses to engage with Dragalia's stupid battle royale mode, because I just sent, saw another player standing around idle next to me. Wow. Wow, first try mail-in. And he gives me a piece of heart. Just for like I said, I'm betting Goron Lullaby is going to be behind reuniting Anju and Cafe. It's just a feeling I have. Let's see, how are you supposed to get to this stupid red switch again? Um, you have to oh, come there's a hook from... There's a hookshot, there's a hookshot yeah. target up there, gotcha. Yeah, you gotta come from the, uh, current room. Oh, and because I have the gore, the circus leader's mask, the, uh, <laughs> protect the carriage minigame is effortless. Just turn that on and they never attack you. Yep.
That is a weird sound that that dog is making. <laughs> A disappointingly large number of things are immune to Fierce Deity's sword beams. Yeah, unfortunately. Alright, Creamy, I'm gonna I defend guess your because milk. They were, he was never programmed to fight most enemies, they just didn't bother making the enemies affected by that sword beam. Right. Yeah, I guess it makes sense. Okay. Oh no, Ganondorf's minions are approaching. <laughs> but they feel so bad for me, they won't attack. I'm trying to think, if it's not- if the Goron Lullaby is not tied to the Anju Cafe side quest. I'm trying to think where it could be. It could be at the Smithy, either with the Gold Dust or the First Day reward. Um, it could be Swamp Skulljula House. It could be, uh, Kyaume Archery, which I'm gonna do on day three. Alright, this room. What else? It could be there's like one, one tingle map we just haven't checked yet. I don't think so, though. Because we've checked the one in Clockdown and Southern Swamp and Romani Ranch, and you checked the one in Akana, right? Yeah, the yeah, one in Akana. I think that should Akana. cover every. Maybe not. Oh, I haven't. I don't know if we've checked the Great Bay map. I'm gonna I'm gonna check that after this just I in case. I don't think he had any I don't think he had anything of particular use. Alright. Creamia? Oh Creamia gave me the giant's mask. Well that would have been useful. I, I, I still think Fierce Deity Well Fierce Deity might actually not be as good. That depends. Alright, I'm just gonna for sanity check. I'm gonna check to see what Tingle's selling at Great Bay. Because I never checked that. I don't know if you did. Um, I th think I did. I don't recall it being anything of particular use, but probably doesn't hurt to double check. I'm going to shoot him down with light arrows. <laughs> if the Goron Lullaby is sold here, I'm going to be like, wow. That would be sad. That would be sad. I right. would be so, I would be sad. What is he and selling? Then... Oh, no, it's nothing. Okay. A red ruby and milk. <laughs> Alright, we've officially checked everything. Tingle related. Now... Oh, I could, ex I could explore more of the well. Yeah. I've got time. I'm gonna explore more of the well. Okay, that was interesting. Real Bombchu saw me, started going berserk, and ended up ramming into a choo choo on the lower area. Oh, wow. <laughs> Killing them both. Alright, there's actually nothing here. We're seriously, we're running out of places to check, so we're gonna find it soon. You'd like to think that, wouldn't you? We're going to find it. So I'm I'm confident we can finish the seed tonight. Then again, I'm also more optimistic than some. Well, I mean, if all else fails, we can peek at the tracker. If all else fails, we can peek at the spoiler log. That is true. I don't like doing that, but we can. Okay, I'm literally missing two masks, and you have the Camaro's mask while I don't, so... <laughs> I wish I remember where it was. Well, this is why we have the spoiler log. Oh, Camaro's mask? Wasn't that in one of the magic bean chests on Star Tower? Yeah, that's right. I think it was in the... It might have been the middle one. Okay. That's right. You can trade that in for Gilded Sword if you're so inclined. I don't really need it. It would just be cool to have all the masks at the end of the seed. <laughs> Ooh, look at all those...
those bombs. I might need those. Okay, there we go. I think I I think the well is like supposed to be designed around um, using Deku sticks, but fire arrows will be just as well. All right, let's see how well Fierce Duty's mask works against Ward. Oh, it's great. Just go to the edge of the pool, Z-target him, and slash him with sword beams. He dies in like two or three hits. That's right, there's a fairy fountain beneath the well. I totally forgot about that. <laughs> What do you want? Something small and creepy. To, uh, I'll have to go back for that. The problem is, without the map to Akana, I can't see where all the chests are in this. Oh well. Yep, four heads and he's dead. It's satisfying, you never even have to touch the water. Alright, this better have a chest. Invisible chest? Invisible chest. Oh, it's this heart. Could, life could up. Be it. Nope, heart container. $20. Alright, I, I think that's actually everything in the well. I might be missing one thing, but I don't think so. I think I got all free chests in there, so. Or I definitely got all. F I definitely got free chests. I can't remember if that's all of them. Though. All right, I think I'm gonna advance to the final day then. Okay, so at this point, our only. So at this point, we are literally just questing for the. Uh, for the lullaby. Yep. Okay, where have we not checked? That I could check. Um, you could check first day, Smithy. Pay them a hundred rupees after m melting their forge on the first day. Uh, can't, because I don't know where the wallet upgrade is. Wallet upgrade is in the grave on the second day. In Akana Graveyard. Right, okay, I can't do that. Alright, Smithy. Did we check first? Did we check the graves on all the days? Uh, yeah. Wow. I, I gave them gold dust to forge, and they gave me five bucks back. What a ripoff. All right, well, time for Kotake, or not Kotake, Kaume Archery. All right, the graveyard's down here. <laughs> the last place I'm going to, literally the last place I will check, well, I guess technically the last place I'll check is Stone Tower Temple, Stray Fairies. But outside of going to Stone Tower Temple, the last place I'm going to check is Swamp School Jewel House. <laughs> I kind of hope it's not in either of those places. Swamp School Jewel House isn't bad, it's just time consuming. Let's see, Day One Grave. Let's see, Day One Grave didn't really have anything, did it? I don't think so. I think it had like a heart container, maybe? A full heart container? I think so. I don't remember. Well, that. I guess I could use that. No real harm. Because you get two fanes going down there. Or no, one of them I think was an empty bottle, maybe. I don't know. Well, that it's, wouldn't it's, hurt either. It's been a while. Alright. Southern Swamp. Alright. That's. <laughs> you literally can't. As far as I can tell, you can't get red potion in this until the third day. <laughs> so you literally can't save Kyome in the woods until day three. Oh wait, if I s the monkey's not gonna be here, is he? Oh, oh he is. For Fierce Deity, a for Fierce Deity, a pack of bats is more dangerous than Majora is. 
kid you not. It's, it's, it's act that's actually true. Stupid monkey, alright. Thanks, thanks, monkey. I know my way now. Let me shoot you in archery. That said, he should. Unless there's something really, really basic that we both forgot about. I don't think so, though. There's not like one grotto somewhere that I didn't explore and that you don't know exists. <laughs> that would be bad. Alright, this is normally Song of Storms. It became a bottle. Okay, okay. I couldn't remember if it was an empty bottle or a heart container. Well, empty bottle's technically stronger because you can put a fairy in it. That's true. I don't really use fairies in this. Yeah, not much. I mean, you don't Especially really since need I started to. Playing that often. I gotta say, Kyame is very understanding of you accidentally shooting her. Like, you have to do it like 20 times before she makes you stop. For me, if, if it happened once, I'd be very upset. Dad, shoot the apple. I think you just need twenty points. Did we race Captain Kita? Did he give us anything? I, I raced Captain Kita. Um he gave me something kind of trash. I don't want to say it was like just Deku Nuts, but it was something pretty trash. I'd have to try to... I'd have to navigate this room with the invisible enemies everywhere, so that's going to be a thing. It's like a zigzag pattern. 30 points, not bad. Piece of work. Okay, well, that works. <laughs> like, oh, I slipped off. I, I just kind of did a roll straight forward, slipped off the ledge, but then the keys, but then the keys gave me a love tap and knocked me across the gap. <laughs> Alrighty then. Well, while I wait for Curiosity Shop Man to let me into Cafe's house, I guess I'll climb Stone Tower and get the owl statue. Oh, I really hope it's not hidden behind Stone Tower Temple Stray Fairies. That would be very tedious. It might, it, literally, though, if, if it's not Anju and Cafe, it has to be there, Swamp, Skulchilla House, or First Day Forge. Like, I think those are the only three places we haven't checked after Anju Cafe. Time to play this song a lot. Wallet upgrade. Yay! <laughs> I guess if one thing you could do if 
if it's looking like Andrew Cafe is going to lead to the thing we need, um, you can try to get Cafe's mask via... Where's that at? So first get the Bremen mask at the bottom of Pinnacle Rock, and then you would need to make the chicks grow up. Except then I'd need to rescue the seahorse, which means I'd need to go take a photo, yeah, of, take, a, take a photo of, the, of the pirates. Of the uh, sexy female pirates. Oh boy. Also, <laughs> I haven't found the mountain title deed. <laughs> I don't. Wait. <laughs> I, no, I, I think I don't think the Goron Wall lies above that floor. Let's see, we checked the bottom. We checked the bottom of the well and got a bunch of nothing. You could you could do a more thorough check. I didn't check every room, but I think I got all the chests. Hmm. I found free chests. I found the chest that normally has the mirror shield. There's a chest in a room near where you get the mirror shield. It's like a room filled with invisible enemies and you light torches and a chest appears. And then there's one on the like opposite end of the maze uh, where it's an other pretty empty room where there's an invisible chest. I think those are the only three in the well. I could be wrong though. Because again, the well is not what I'm most familiar with. I'm getting tired of hearing the Gerudo pirates scream all the time in Stone Tower. I don't even know what sound effect that's replacing. Uh, is it like constantly playing in Stone Tower? In Stone Tower, like every few seconds, I hear the sound of a Gerudo pirate being like killed. Like, ah! um, probably replacing the sound of the rolling rocks then. Well, I still hear the sound of the rolling rocks. Maybe there's a sound where they first appear or something. I don't know. Or when a, or probably when a rock, probably when the rock like falls and then lands on the ground, that's probably the sound that's getting replaced. Probably, it's probably something to do with the rolling rocks and half an eight press. Uh, nice. I still forget my way up stone tower sometimes. I think this is the top. Okay. Oh, you sack of crap! Bad news. If that makes me restart all of stone... It will. You fall once and then you all the way back to the start, aren't you? I was literally one second away from hookshotting the last fiend and a fire keys knocked me all the way down to the bottom. And I, d I didn't even see it. It was literally just like came out of nowhere. Apparently, a fire key is like the fattest fire piece ever, and was able to literally knock Link completely down the bottom of, of Stone Tower. Screw that. That sucked. Well, it's especially bad because normally the fire keys like don't even do anything. I know. Then. Why did he knock me completely 100% off the platform? It didn't even make sense. All right, Curiosity Shop, man. You got two things for me. I hope one of them is the Goron Lullaby. Twenty bucks. And twenty bucks. Okay. <laughs> there cash, we go. Cash, cash money, yo. <laughs> it's like it's a cash money gold mine. All right, well... It is. Uh, is the fisherman so? just not here during the night time? What? 
I guess the fisherman's just not in his shack at the night time. Did you already beat Great Bay Temple? Uh, yeah. Oh, then you can't get the seahorse. You, you don't need uh, the seahorse to get through it. I guess I'll just have to uh, spam safe states until I uh, figure you out where You I'll basically just follow are. the arrow signs. It's not too hard. But yeah, you can spam state save states. Or, or reset the cycle. I don't know what day you are on in the cycle. To night of second. Uh, oh yeah, because you got the wallet upgrade. Alright, well, I mean... If it's not Anjou and Cafe, it's either First Day, Smithy, uh, Swamp Sculptural House, or Stone Tower Temple Stray Fairies. Alright. Take two of Stone Tower Temple. That is really stupid how there are no checkpoints on here. <laughs> also, keep in mind, you are ahead of me in this seed because you have beaten three dungeons. I've only beaten two. This is literally a seed where I've basically checked every single place. <laughs> or between the two of us, we've checked almost every single place. Yeah. This ended up being a worse seed than we thought it was going to be. <laughs> Maybe next time we'll enforce junk locations on all the Stray Fairy locations. <laughs> We kind of had the misfortune of finding almost everything we needed right away, and that means there was a ton of places where the last, like, two things we needed could be. And it happened to be in one of the worst places. Again, or we're just completely missing something. Yeah. Oh, wait. No, I'm pretty sure I checked Bomb Shop after saving the old one. Yeah, yeah, I checked that. What the, uh, big bomb bag turned into. I'm not being super paranoid of the keys. <laughs> okay, it's just at the bottom, yeah. Yeah, just go to the bottom in one of the two caves, there's a treasure chest. That has the Bremen mask. The Elegy of Emptiness was a little easier to okay. play. It's a long song. But it's also very one of the most memorable songs for me because it just take, only takes the C stick. That's true. I mean, so then does again, the, so does the New Wave Bossa Nova, Nova, and yet I tend to forget what the New Wave Bossa Nova is. I get those two confused. Neither of them are particularly memorable to me. They're not like really catchy like the Ocarina songs were. Okay, Bremen Mask. I hate Beemos. Beemoses are some of the most annoying enemies for me. They're pretty bad. Especially in the 2D Zelda games where you literally can't kill them. <laughs> okay, let's see. I can use the Bremen Mask to do the flippity gibbet. Does it have? To, is there any day requirement on that, or uh, any of the three days work? Okay, I will have to uh, go buy another powder keg to get in, or I can just wait till day three. Wait, just wait till day three. Uh, uh no, wait, no, I'm still in the same cycle apparently. Does it have to be day? Uh, I think it has to be day. Otherwise, I think Grog is sleeping in the cuckoo shack, and it's locked. Yeah, there's a key around here. The key is not here, he's up here. Yeah, you scum of the earth. You're gonna die. 
is it to ensure you can't kill me a second time. Oh, here's the doggy racetrack. Was there anything at the doggy racetrack? Uh, 150 bet gives you Gibdo mask. Um, okay, I don't really think I need that. Or not 150 bet, 50 rupee or more bet and winning. At least I'm pretty sure that's what the Gibdo mask was. Please be, please. Okay, good. There's the freaking owl statue. Just in time to have to go and meet Cafe outside of Saikon's hideout. Turbo mode, please, because marching around here, gathering up all the chicks, takes so long. Yes, it does. Every time I roll off the canyon as Goron, I drown. Yeah, that's not good. Alright, where's the last little yellow fluff ball? Come here, you. Oh yeah, I forgot there's also a red potion in Akana Canyon, but that that requires me to get the ocean sculpture. Hey bro, don't worry about me, I'm just a stone. He's not gonna notice me. Okay, cat face mask. I, I have I have a pretty strong hunch that the mobile well, buy is going to be reuniting Andrew and Cafe. Okay, it's well honestly then I'm gonna get I'm just gonna get started on that. Um did we already get both options for turning in the letter to mama? I don't yes. think we ever turned it in. I turned did it, it turn in, it in person and it was nothing. Oh yeah, alright. I think I recall that. Okay, because um I was I was like, do you ever need to enter the milk bar to get anything? Because that would require you to get all the Zora eggs and you don't. There's nothing in the milk bar. Let's see. This means, of course, I have to remember how the Andrew Cafe quest actually works. All right. So, sometime on the first day after the postman talks to Andrew, you have to talk to her of Cafe's mask and then meet her at night, starting at midnight and before the night's over in the kitchen. Talk to her. Then you need to get the letter for Cafe, which is hidden in the Southern Swamp Grotto near the Sculptula House. Mail that in the. Postbox. All right, you have to wait. For, right, his immediately cafe puts his letter in the mailbox. You wait for the postman to get it. You meet up with her when she delivers it. Da 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 da. Yep. This is also, I believe, this is the first time I'm completing the Andrew Cafe side quest on the randomizer. I could be totally wrong about that though. I've played this a few. All times. right, we're both working on it. I feel like that's not the most efficient, but honestly, I. If you want to do day one Smithy, then. Well, that means I need to find the gold dust. Where's that? No, at? gold dust is second day. First day, you just give them a hundred rupees. Right, hundred dollars for that guy. Yep. Now it's the legend of cafe. I've always liked the theory that like everyone in Termina has a Hylian counterpart, and cafe's Hylian counterpart is Link. And then I guess, uh, failing that, I guess I'll just go after stray fairies and, uh... Stone Tower. <laughs> uh, Stone Tower. <laughs> if you'd rather do that than the Swamp Sculpture House, then I'm all for that. I kind of would, because I don't like the Swamp Sculpture House, but with having to go grab magic beans to do things. You don't need magic beans. You need bugs. Oh, right, you just need, like, bugs and hook shots and stuff. Or Zora Boomerangs. Okay, let's see. Smithy, smithy. That means I'm gonna need to go grab some money. Wait. Why can't... Oh, uh, why can't I push that? Take that. Save the sun mask. Hmm. 
Well then, I wonder if I... Oh yeah, it's only midnight. I think I have enough time to beat Stone Tower Temple before I go back to Andrew and Cafe. Okay, go to Mountain Village. Because I too would really like to not have to get all the stray fairies in Stone Tower. All this for the Goron Guard. For <laughs> the Goron uh, Lullaby. Oh man, it is well hidden. <laughs> I just realized I don't think I even need to be in right side up stone tower temple. I think I can do literally just the upside down part. Unless I need a small key from. No, I don't think I need a small key. I think I think we're good. Mm -hmm. I think we're good. That's the one I wanted. Yes. <laughs> All right, what's your hot item? It's twenty dollars. <laughs> Behold, Smithies my skills and crafts are truly unrivaled. Money. Yeah, your skills and craftsmanship are truly unrivaled. All right. They literally just have a printing press in there, making counterfeit money and ripping people off to buy it. Yep. If you give us a hundred bucks, we'll make you a red rupee. Okay, I guess I'll head to Stone Tower. All right, I'm also in. I'm also in Stone Tower. <laughs> Why don't you grab the stray fairies when you're there? Because I don't have I'll enough leave. time left in the cycle to get them all. How? Oh. I just want to beat Twin Mold because I still need to do that. <laughs> Okay, grab the Chateau Romani again. That's weird. Eat. There's no there's no music at all in this dungeon. For me. Weird. I wonder if it's just because it's the final hours. Could be. Could be for did your final hours get set to silence? That would be weird. Well no, my final hours are normal uh, outside the dungeon, but I thought it's supposed to be in the real game. The dungeon music overrides the final hours music, but I, I'm getting no dungeon music at all. Hmm. Okay, grab arrows, grab bombs. It's very eerie in here. Okay, wow, let's music. see. Is there anything we need to take into the Skulltola house? Or so me and I guess I'll try the Skulltola house. Anything to take in? Nope. Apart from some bottles. I don't think so. Grab a stick. That should be plenty. Bad horn cicada. Okay, I think this has a small key in it. Yeah, yeah. This is the small key chest I was looking for. Get out of here, you stupid cicada. There we go, that's what I'm looking for. I think it's this way. Booyah. That was the most pathetic jump I've ever seen, Deku Link. Nice backwards flight. Alright, this is the first of many. Yep. <laughs> I just have the, the bell constantly raining. <laughs> if 
revenge you and Cafe give me Goron Lola. It's like, can I beat Snowhead Temple in one hour? <laughs> Probably not. Probably not. I can beat Snowhead pretty quickly, though. I don't think that's- I don't think that's possible. Okay, here's the bugs. All I need to do is use the levitation glitch to get to the top. <laughs> and get the boss key. <laughs> Nobody in their right mind playing the game normally would enter Stone Tower Temple and try to beat it when there are only six hours left in game left. <laughs> Oh, but it's a funny idea. I'm pretty familiar with Stone Tower. At least, not so much when it comes to getting the Stray Fairies, but when it comes to just getting to the dungeon end, and the dungeon is normal, yeah. There we go. Door opens. Midi boss time. Okay, little buggy dudes, do your thing. Summon spider. Spider collect. Spider collect. Let me pause so I can... There's more bugs. Stop warping around, Wizrobe. That. Bashing my face into the spider. Spider collect. That was unfortunate. <laughs> he spawned right next Black. to me. I'm pretty sure there's a spider milling about on one of these pillars in there. Yep, here it is. I don't even need Fierce Duty's mask. Yeah, gum mess is pretty easy. <laughs> but cool, he's but he's so pretty easy. Awesome. He's so awesome. Interrupt one fanfare with another. Ah! Shot the beehive when I was right under it, and the spider almost fell on my face. That's not good. Thank you. 
literally though, if it actually is Stone Tower Temple Scrapers, I'm gonna be kind of ticked. That will literally be the last place we check. <laughs> it's Stone Tower. Of course it'll be the last place we check because once we get it, we stop looking. Okay, fine. The last place that we it could possibly be. Ho ho. Again, unless I'm forgetting something that I don't think I am. How did that possibly hit me? That was just five dollars for doing that. <laughs> hmm, the music in here died. Oh well. Yeah, like, there's literally no Stone Tower Temple inverted music for me. Uh, doggone it, I'm so stupid. I'm like, okay, I can't forget to get the small key before coming here, and I forgot to get the small key before coming here. Whoops. Do, do, do. Spider collect. <laughs> No matter where it is, it's going to be annoying for one of us. <laughs> if it's Andrew's yep. Cafe, it's going to be annoying for you. Oh, that that is weird. I see what you mean, yeah. You can get up to this staircase, but then nothing. Yeah, that is weird. Yeah, and it's like that in the vanilla game, too. I just never noticed. Am I missing something here? Okay, no, I was just on the wrong side. Dear me. This is the way. This is the way of the mm -hmm. <laughs> So my, <laughs> I'm trying to predict what five items are going to be on the moon. Actually, I think there might be six items on the moon. Twenty dollars, twenty dollars, twenty dollars, twenty dollars. I have a, I have a feeling the, I have a feeling the mountain title deed will be up there as well as the biggest quiver. Biggest quiver would be useful if we didn't already have fierce TD's mask. <laughs> Maybe just a few Deku Nuts as well. Because I don't think we've found the Deku Nut chest yet. Then again, there's also going to be a ton of chests in either in Snowhead Temple or that we can't get till after Snowhead Temple that we'll have that stuff as well. There's like four chests I can think of off the top of my head that we can't get till after Snowhead Temple. Plus Dongaro's mask. On it. Is this the way? That's. I am so dumb. I went back to Gomez's room, forgetting that this is completely the wrong way. I, I forgot there was a. It's not completely the wrong way. I just overshot it. Away. Oh come off it! Uh, no wait, this one's on the floor, so I shouldn't need one more bug, right? Um, one of the soil patches does not have a sculpture in it. Are you sure it's not two? Oh well, whatever. I'm pretty close to the bug room. I can... I always just keep duplicated bugs. Alright, here we go. I don't remember how you get in that hole. Despite that massive goof up, I will still... this dungeon in time. I think you're intended to use a magic bean, but if you're a, a tall form, you can just roll jump over across it. So I don't need to worry about that. I think, I think, yeah, you literally just can roll jump to it. Yeah. Or I or a hook shot. Or Zora Boomerang. Yeah. <laughs> 
So, um... <laughs> I have 15... Heart, it? I have 15 heart containers. Well, I've got, uh, eight. <laughs> Chest on the ceiling, did it, did it, did it, chest on the ceiling. Oh, that's right, that hive just has a bee in it. <laughs> Two of them have specials though. Alrighty. Right. Time for twin mold. Spider collect. Spider collect. Spider collect. Giant masked insect twin. I'm still down four spiders. Um, did you roll into the tree in the bug room? I just did that, yeah. That just gives root, that just gives arrows. Let's see. Honestly, Twin Mold is still not trivial even with Fierce Deity Mask. Okay, I've checked all of the soil patches. This is why I hate Swamp Spider House. I've checked all of, because it's the harder one. I've checked all of the soil patches. I've scoured every room. I'm not hearing any more spider sounds anywhere, and I'm still down three. There's a beehive in the bug room that contains the skull. That one I always miss. Pretty sure I shot all the beehives. Um, there are two in the pots. Pretty sure I broke everything. Not in the pot, the giant vases. In the... I just got those, yeah. Um, did you cut the grass in that room as well? Yeah, the, the one hidden behind the grass wall, I got did, that. Did you shoot the beehives on the ceiling in, like, the gold-plated room? Yep, we got all those. Okay. You broke the pots. You did all... There are three that are hidden in soil patches. You got all of them? All of them, yep. Uh, did you destroy the crates in the dirt room? The room. Pretty the sure. Um, you got all the ones on the pillars in the main room. Oh, no, wait, hold on. I think I missed a beehive one. Yep, there's the beehive one. Alright, Andrew and Cafe, they are about to be reunited. Okay. Still down two. I really do hate Swamp Spider House. Oh wow, this is the first time I've ever come to Anjun Cafe's room after Cafe's already been there. I'm normally just waiting there for him. Mm-hmm. <laughs> They're already gone, no. And then they hug to the tune of Zelda's lullaby. And what do they fork over is more important. Oh wait, oh wait. If hey <laughs> If this is actually the couple's mask, that could be funny, because the mayor could have. Mayor could it's have a bottle of red potion. Welp. Whoopee. 
Guess I'm doing straight fairies in Stone Tower Temple. <laughs> Guess I'm looking up a walkthrough to figure out where these last two freaking spiders are, because I hate this place. I can never find where the spiders are. Despite... This always happens to me. I run four or five laps around this place, scouring every inch I can think of, and can never find them. Yep. That's about right. Swamp Spider House sucks! I know I haven't solved the problem at Snowhead. I can't solve the problem yeah, at Snowhead. The, yeah, Tattles been on me about that, too. Oh, boy. All right, back to Stone Tower. Okay, more like off to a walkthrough for me, because I can't figure out where the last spiders are. See, I'm not I, hearing I, any I rustling like in any... Swamp Sculpture has, this, I think, a lot easier than the ocean one. The ocean one has some more sneaky stuff. Yeah, but I, the sneaky stuff makes it more memorable, so I remember where it all is. Oh, fair enough. This house, no, I don't. And I just scour the place 12 times, and I never find where the stuff is. Drives me absolutely insane. I still think you've got the better view. I'd much, much rather do Swamp Sculpture than Stone Tower Stray Fairies. Be my guest. But you're so close to it, so... So unless I'm mistaken, it's either Swamp Sculpture House, Stone Tower Stray Fairies, or we forgot something in the well. Alright. I think time to go look at the guide and figure I out what these stupid things be. are. I think worst case scenario for this is we do both of these and then we find out that it's actually not hidden there at all. And that it's in a place that we just have forgotten about. Okay, guess I'll just have to go through the list one at a time and check every single one. I freaking hate dragonflies! Why are they so annoying with such wonky hitboxes? Loving it! Gosh, the real the real bomb chews up close look like the plague rat of doom from Earthbound. Absolutely 100% not in the tree room.
Ah, beehives up here. In this room. I forgot about the beehives in this room. There's beehives in almost every room. Which beehives did you miss? Was in the vase room? The ones in the vase room. Oh, those are the ones I always remember. That's only two, though. Those were the only two I was missing. Oh, I thought you were missing three. No, nah, I found the last one. Okay. Okay. No whammies, no whammies, no whammies. Come on, big money. No whammies. Fifty dollars. <laughs> no! <laughs> yeah, that's a pretty big whammy. Literally, if it's not Stone Tower Temple Stray Fairies, I have no clue where it is. Yeah, I'd say if it's not Stone Tower Temple Stray Fairies, then it's spoiler log time. Not before I rack my brain real hard. I think it has to be Stone Tower Stray Fairies, though. If it's not that, I'm gonna take another dip into the well. Maybe I should just warp over there and start on it myself. You could. Although I have, I feel like it must be. Are you? What? Tell you what you could do. You could see, look up to see how many chests there are in the well. Because I got three of them. Hmm. Hey, Majora's Mask beneath the well. so dumb for not knowing how many checks there are, but... Oh, I hate this. There's so many stone tower temple rooms that I hate, but honestly, the room where you have to perfectly dive out of the water as a Zora is one of my least favorites. I freaking... Hmm. It's so precise. Yeah, that one can be annoying, but usually it doesn't end up giving me that much trouble. No, I have to try it like 20 times every time. It's so freaking annoying. Always end up jumping into the pillar on the planet. Stupid bombs, why are you underwater anyways? Like, I swear, 90% of the time I leap out of the water, I literally can't even possibly go high enough. Like, the angle's just... There we go, finally. So there's a nice small key. A small key is exactly what we need to open a small key. I wonder if they if they ever made Majora's Mask Master Quest, what would the dungeons have looked like? Hmm. Yeah, that'd be kind of interesting. Hopefully they'd be better designed than the Ocarina of Time Master Temple Quest dungeons. Hmm. It, uh... Well, this isn't telling me how many items there are. I think it's because... Um, yeah, do I have the Gibdo mask? No, you need dog race. I mean, I guess I could go do dog race. I don't know how I pushed that switch, but okay. <laughs> oh, that's fine. Can you do dog race on third day? Yes, provided it's not okay. the night time. I don't feel like buying another powder keg. There we go. Melt that ice block.
That's the, that's the, the, the annoying thing about Stone Tower Temple, Stray Fairies, is like you, you get a chest and it always appears upside down, so you constantly have to flip the dungeon. Mm hmm. It's so dumb. <laughs> Better to just go through, hit all the switches, and then come back, hit all the switches, and then so you only have to do like one or two oh, laps. Oh, that was terrifying. I opened a chest with one of those rats right next to me, and it was legit terrifying. Staring into your soul. And yeah, and he was like literally right next to me. It was too close for comfort. I believe it's this one? <laughs> oh man, I even remembered which of the six sons makes a chest appear. Nice. It's almost like okay, now it's before. Gold Doggy Always Wins, yeah? Gold Doggy Always Wins if you have Lens of Truth. Or not Lens of Truth, Mask of Truth. Hmm. Which we do. Yep. And Blue Doggy, like, always loses. Oh, I forgot about you, creepy blob of Goron Head. Gold Doggy says, today I should do pretty well. Oh, yes, he will. Lava Pit Goron Deku Room. It's so easy to just accidentally hit something as a Goron. Whew! I made it though. I swear they put that much stuff in your way on purpose. Dang, he smoked them! <laughs> Let me guess, Blue Dog. Poor little Blue Dog. Blue Dog finished last? Yep. Poor little Blue Dog. He had too many doggy treats before attempting to race. It's the chest I always almost forget about. It takes so long to get the stray fairies, too. Okay, let's collect some of the items that we're gonna need to get through the well. We're gonna need the uh, blue potion. Uh, get I'd get ten magic beans. I think you only need five, but I'd get ten just in case. So I, you'll have to go to the bean cellar. Sure I think you, you actually. Money. I think you actually do need ten. Yeah, blue potion. That makes sure you have Deku nuts. Gotta get the blue potion from the fortress. Deku nuts. How many Deku nuts do you need? I get twenty. I think it's like ten. I know one of them wants ten, but oh my gosh, that should not have worked. But I made it for the annoying Deku flying part. Give me that stray fairy. Uh, uh, your hands are cold. Don't touch me. Talking to real life person. Um. Oh. Garo Master and his great laugh. Okay, farm this Deku Baba for Deku Nuts. Hi, Garo Master. Garo Master, how do you Oh yeah, I forgot Garo Master dies in two jump slashes from the Great Fairy Sword. <laughs> Downside being that with the Great Fairy Sword you can't really block his counter attack. I uh, but you can you can backflip. You just have to have the right timing. You'd have to be super precise. Yeah. I've learned. Alrighty. Piece of heart. Okay, that's need more of those. Um, let's see, what else? I need to go grab the blue potion. Let's see, I've got ten bombs to fork over. What the heck? What was that? 
I've never seen such bull in my life. Mm hmm. I, okay, so you, you know those annoying cicadas with the uh, the helmets, right? Oh yeah, the. So, uh, so if they if they if they smash in, so if they smash into you, they're supposed to knock you really far, and I get that. I literally just jumped into one, and it rocketed me backwards like I was the Apollo 13 going off the launch pad. <laughs> nice. Okay, I have to head to you. Pirates you. Cove oh, and grab the blue potion. And I don't mean that place from Dragon Tales. Yeah, oh, not so tough without that, huh? Eat the taste of pure light. Oh, hey Cyclops, what you, what you, uh, what you doing today? Uh oh. That is not good. I'm out of magic, and I don't have anything to restore it. And I forgot to get Chateau Romani. I have to hit that. And there switch is literally again. nothing in the room to restore my magic. Can you uh, can, can you kill the Cyclops guys? Oh yes, you can. You can kill them with normal arrows. Yeah, no, arrows I, I threw a bomb in his eye. Guy <laughs> gores. Oh, is that what they're called? I always call them Cyclopses. That's what they are. Thank goodness I get the straight there. Eight down. Seven to go. Alright, fake it you. Get your butt out of here. Oh no. Oh no. Oh thank goodness the dragonfly clipped into the floor and didn't get me. All right, well, before I, before I continue with this upside-down dungeon, I'm going to get me some Chateau Romani. Didn't grab it immediately at the start of I the cycle? I forgot to. <laughs> it is great when there's Chateau Romani just really close to the start. Taxes. Aha. Aha. The birds are singing. Isn't it beautiful? <laughs> Sire, they might be bandits. Oh, puppycock. Female bandits. What went next? Then Prince John's sexism becomes his downfall. Okay, now I have to go and... Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's see, I think you did all the Song of Healing checks, yeah? I think so. I did Camaro, I did Macau, I did Darmani. I think that... And I did Pamela's Father. Mm -hmm. so I think that's all of them. Okay, let's see. I need to go to Southern Swamp and buy me up large quantities of <laughs> flibbity gibbet. Actually, I think, wouldn't burping to Woodfall be faster? For what? Getting to the Deku Palace so I can reach the salesman and yeah. spend yeah. all my money on beans. I think Summer Swamp would honestly be faster, especially if you roll through the poison water. Yeah, they, which they, I do. Now we get though. the Woodfall Temple music. Uh. For some reason, in Woodfall, the poison water actually just knocks you flying. I'm not sure why the difference, but... Um, I thought... Does it actually? I thought it was... Yeah, it knocks you off your feet for some reason. Huh. Or at least knocking Zora Link off his feet. That's not... With maybe, the poison maybe, water. maybe because the poison water is more concentrated in Woodfall. I guess, but... It's bad enough that it knocks you off your feet? Apparently. 
which ironically actually makes it a lot less hazardous because then you get more iframes. Yeah, but if it keeps knocking you backwards, then you... It was knocking me forward. <laughs> well, that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> Slower, but less deadly. Feels like I was just in this dungeon. Oh, wait. It sees the bean salesman to the left, I think. Loving it! Of course, another upside down chest. These are just very annoying. Alright, you stupid guards, get out of the way. Nobody likes avoid the guard sequences. Well, you've got stone mask. I do. No, this is the wrong direction. He's on the other side. He's on the, the east. Yep. Stupid cicada with the helmet. Alright, open that chest. Give me that Give. fairy. Give. Give. I really hate the camera in this game sometimes. It's like it's actually a step down from the Ocarina of Time camera. Why am I moving like molasses on the floor? Your camera is like a big step down from the Ocarina of Time camera, and I don't know why. Uh, uh, okay, let's see. So Ten bombs, blue bad. potion, magic beans, Deku nuts, empty bottles. I think I have everything I need. And Gibdo mask. All course. the rest you'll be able to find. In... Okay, got everything I need. If the blue potion and the magic beans are the big ones that, like, you actually need to get before you go there. I think all the rest can be found within the well. Wait, where does this lead? I'm very... Wait. Wait, wait, what? I'm so confused! Mm hmm? What? I'm so confused! About what? I just... Okay, so... Do you know that room in the Stone Tower Temple? You go up in the corner with the spike bombs, you open the door, and then there's the passage where you have to flip it upside down to, like, go through the lava pits, then flip it back right side up. I flipped it upside yeah. down, then I realized, wait, there's a door here that's right side up. I went through it, and then it was back to being upside down again. <laughs> the... yeah. Coding! I think, I think they put it there just so you couldn't completely screw yourself up if you ran out of arrows in that room, like I literally just did. Hmm. Blow him up! Come on, Link! Blow him to Kingdom Come! Thank you. Kingdom Come! Now I, now I need to find some arrows. There we go. Okay, blue potion. Get that oh, out wow. of the way. They, they literally put that door in that makes no sense just so you couldn't sequence break yourself into a soft lock. That's actually very that's very nice. Fish get. It's just very confusing. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Mm. Oh, I always like rolling mommy, into oh, blah, 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 blah. oh, oh wait. 
Actually, I think it does make sense, because I think it's not... I think when you hit the jewel in this room, it's not the whole temple that turns upside down. I think it's just this room that turns upside down. In which case, because when you turn it upside down, the new door is in the exact same place as the old door. No, okay, okay, that actually does make sense. Let's see, we got more fish here. Fire. Okay, well, there's the hot spring water there, but I don't remember which guy needs that. Hot spring water, a guy on the opposite end of the maze needs it. Of course it's a guy on the opposite end of the maze. If you don't have it, I have no need for you away. I didn't know that they were actually singing their theme song. <laughs> Yes, yes, I caught a fish in the bottle. Throw it away, I don't want it, I want the water. <laughs> there we go. Leave it, leave it, leave you water. Ah, uh, this, this, I bear you no remorse. Open the door! Unfortunately, if it is the Stone Tower Temple Stray Fairies, you're gonna Then have... I'm posed. Then I'm gonna have to follow in your footsteps and go get them all. Yep. In which case, I might explore all of, Stone... of Snowhead just to see what's there. Because <laughs> it would be boring if one of us finished the seed way before the other. Honestly, if one of us finished it, if, if honestly if you finished the seed first, I'd be fine with just saying to heck with it and calling it good because okay. we know how it would okay. unfold from there. Well, fair enough. I'm definitely glad this was a cooperative seed and not a race. Yeah. Tank. Yes, yes, yes. Very funny. Get out of the Already, way. Already, the, the Majora seeds tend to be so long that it's hard to do a single race. Anyways. No floor master, no no wall master. Nobody loves you. Wall masters are annoying. Especially when their sound effects are randomized and you don't know what their sound effect is. Which has happened. Let's see, get this guy out of the way. Keys. Visible treasure chest, gilded, heart container. Yeah, I found the heart container down there. That'll help you out. Yeah, at this point, I've got enough life that I don't really need it. Well, I thought so too, and then I died bugs. to Ego Sikana. But then again, you've confirmed that we don't need to deal with Egos to Akana, right? Correct. Oh, and I, I don't think I even have to deal... No, I don't have to beat Gomez again, because there's nothing his way. Except the boss key, and I don't need to... Yeah, the only thing he guards is the boss key. Okay. I mean, I like Gomez, but I don't like reaching him. Let's see, isn't this guy just guarding a fairy's family? Yo. I can't remember if one of them wants a fairy or not. Okay. I don't think there is. I guess Gomez is barely out of the way at all. It's just, it just takes a while to reach him. I think that would be kind of defining what out of the way is. Well, it, there's one room, you just, it takes, like, uh, five seconds to reach you. Uh, you, have, you, have to, you have to shoot bombs down out of the sky and take the flowers to him. And then do it again. Alright, how many stray fairies do I have? Eleven out of fifteen. I think there's only three treasure chests in here, I think I'm just kind of wasting my time here. Oh no, he does only want five of them. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Here, take your beans. Alright. You can die. 
has got nothing because that was the giant's mask. Just already got that. Ouch. Hit that switch, make an upside down chest appear. Because of course it's an upside down chest. actually enter the flying Waba Deku room upside down or not. I don't think I have access to my spoiler log, do I? You have access to the spoiler log, log yeah. Do I have it hanging around here? You should. Song log. Oh, that's just telling me what the... So that, that's the Gomez room that I didn't go into. Okay, that, one, that one is upside down. That one, I don't do. That one is upside down. That one is upside down. That's the boss key chest. The one on top here, I think, is also upside down. I don't think I kept the yeah. spoiler log. I think I threw it away. Oh, I still have it. All right, I, I've, I think, you need to have this I think I'm logic to the... confirm how many chests are in here, because if it's only yeah, three, yeah, yeah, already got yeah. them all. Then I can confirm that. All right. Beneath the whoa, whoa, hey not. Yeah, there's only three chests and then the cow. So we have, okay, we so have, so we are done with the well guaranteed. Because cows are not part of our logic. Correct. All right. I, unless I'm mistaken, I think I'm done with upside down Takana. Was I going to do something before? No, I don't think so. Turns out that like we just forgot about it in a shop somewhere. <laughs> I don't think that's it. Where it's like, oh, we forgot it was in the Magic Hags potion shop, but <laughs> we just couldn't afford it when we first went there. Or if it's like, oh, well, we never checked Tingle at Snowhead, so <laughs> he's actually selling it at the Snowhead map. I'm just, I'm, pre I'm preparing myself for the potential that Stray Fairies and Stone Tower don't lead to Goron Lullaby. I think they have to at this point, but in case they don't, I'm trying to think of places both of us haven't checked yet. And I'm kind of coming out Trump. Yeah, same here. Like, I'm coming up a whole lot of bumpkiss. Do I, really, so do I really have to take the long way around all the way back to the Garo Master Room just to get the chest in me? I think so. If so, that's sucky. Right, this is gonna have a straight fairy, I know that. Okay. Oh, stupid dragonfly. Eat an arrow of pure light. Did here I hear a chunky booing? Probably. They are the best place. Mm. <laughs> 
I repeat, the camera really sucks at times. upside down. What do you mean that's... That wasn't there when I was upside down! in this dungeon. It's so bad. And now I have to go to the stupid Garo Master room again, which requires flying the stupid Deku flower again. That... Flower flying in this dungeon is so ridiculously precise. Yeah, because apparently there was a chest upside down that wasn't there until I went right side up, but apparently it was there all along, but it wasn't. <laughs> Stone Tower Temple. Cool concept, bad execution. So this is going to have one of two things. It's going to either have the Goron Lullaby, or it's going to have the Couples Mask, and that'll lead to the Goron Lullaby. If not, well, I'm in trouble. Just shoot the stupid jewel! Come on, I've shot it like five times now. It's a chest that's close to the entrance. Mercifully. Sure, sure enough, it is. Give fairy. Oh yeah, it's the chest that's like impossible to get. I think without the hook shot. Fat lard sack. Blubby boy. I can't remember if this is the chest that, like, you can't get with the hook shot, or you can't get without the hook shot. Camera. Stop sucking! Good lord! The camera is atrocious in this dungeon. It's, like, screwed me over 18 times. Okay, this is the one you need the hook shot. No. Just shot the Dane chest. Hook shot the Dane chest. There's literally nothing in your way. Oh, I. There is literally nothing in the way. Why couldn't you freaking hook shot it? And that stupid cicada making noise over and over again is not helping. There we go. Jeez. All the stray fairies. Finally. Did you get them? I got them all. It took way longer than it should have. Wow. 
Wow. The... <laughs> well, I don't I don't have the Goron Lullaby yet, so if if it is here though, wow, this was like the absolute worst possible seed, basically. <laughs> Fun time. It literally makes it literally made us look everywhere. Come on, stop it, Gibdos. You can't stop me from entering the fairy fountain. You can't stop me. Fairy fountain. It's the map of Clock Town. It wasn't there. It's the what? It was the map of Clock Town. It wasn't there. Spoiler log time, I say. You think it's we time? For so long. I wanna... It's gotta be something stupid that we missed, unless you can figure I, out what it let, is. Let me, okay, let me just run through all the locations in my head again. Okay. So I think in South Clock Town we had the two chests on the walls. I got those. Did we ever do all three, um... Deku Playground? Deku Playgrounds. Yes, I believe we did. I did. Yeah, I did. I did it. Um, we did both of the f Great Fairy Fountains there. I saved the old lady from being mugged. I did the bigger bomb bag in the shop. I think we've looked at everything in the shops. I did both of Granny's stories. Oh, I know what I'm gonna try. It's a long shot, because I don't think this gets randomized. Did we talk to Shiro the Stone Soldier? We have not! That's it. Oh my gosh, it's Shiro. Okay. He's um, got it, doesn't he? he which must means have I need it. to go Which okay. means I need to go pick up Lens of Truth. Yeah, Lens of Truth was uh, in in the well. It was in where the blah, 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 blah. where the It was mirror uh, shield, where the mirror, mirror, shield, mirror shield, shield usually is. Okay, uh Red Potion. I saw one. Oh yeah. Oh, where's the ocean's title deed? Actually, you know what? No, I'm just going to Clock Town for a day. It's on top of the tower. I can get a red potion. I totally forgot about Shiro. Good call. Oh, and now I'm ticked that I did all those Street Fairy stuff. <laughs> I had just started on it myself. In case you were right, and then I was going to have to, you know, play catch up with you. Oh, I figured if I was right, you were just going to say, all right, I'm going to watch you finish the seed. <laughs> that could have, we could have done that too. Okay, grab the red potion. Um... Okay, yeah, it must be Shiro. Because if not, I think we've done everything in Termina. I've done all the grottos. I did the Gossip Stone Grottoes. I did the secret Deku Grotto, where you have to look at the telescope. I did the ones in the tall grass. Got the chest in the tall grass. Got the chest on the stump. Got the underwater chest. Got the Bio De Deku Bob one. I think you're right. I think it has to be Shiro. I totally forgot about him. Well, that's very fitting we forgot about Shiro. <laughs> fitting, yes, but not helpful to our cause. My only other thought, I don't think this gets randomized, but we could try... I have the Mask of Sense. I could find a mushroom in the forest and give it to Kotake. I think, in, I think unless you randomize miscellaneous stuff, she always gives you 20 bucks. But it could have just been in the last randomizers. Every time I've done it, she just always gave 20 bucks because that's more blue there. I just want to note that, like, I think there are four red potions scattered throughout the world, and three of them are only accessible on the third day. Hmm. And they're not sold in any shop, as far as I can tell. Actually, they might be sold at the trading post. I literally... I, I haven't been there in ages. Shiro, I'm coming to save you. If he has either the the Goron Lullaby or mask the Couples up. Mask. Because the mayor could have the Goron Lullaby as well. We're going through so much trouble just to put that stupid baby Goron to sleep. Okay, Shira, where are you at? No, he's in a circle of rocks somewhere around here in Akana. 
there he is. On the path to Akana. Oh, you got there first? Do you have the red potion as well? I do. Where did you get the red potion? I grabbed the one on top of the clock tower. I'm already on day three. Ah, uh, okay. Twenty dollars. Dog on it. <laughs> Curse you, Shiro! You waste of life. <laughs> hey, that's all he had. Okay, okay. Big. We got a big brain. This. Okay. Where could it possibly be? Uh I think we've done it. I, I'm almost positive I've done everything in Great Bay. I did both the beaver races. I got both the chests going up there. I killed the like like. Got the underwater uh, chest. Through the bomber's notebook again. Is there anybody we're missing out of the bomber's notebook? I don't want to open it because at least on my emulator, last time I opened it, it crashed my game. Uh, works just fine on my emulator. Okay. Um, so the Rose of Sisters did not have it. It's not one of the bank rewards because we I already got both of those. Um, it's not at the Curiosity Shop. It wasn't because it, it was not the All Night Mask. I, it wouldn't be in the Bomb Shop. You did Swordsman School and I just gave Bomb, bomb Shoes. I did the Postmates yeah. game. We did both of the letters to Mama. I did Town Archery 1. It can't be Town Archery 2. I'm just going to double check, make sure it's not Town Archery 2. Yeah, Town Archery 2, that's just a piece of art. Okay, did we do everything in Akana? Because we've only recently got it. So I defeated Ego Sakana. The heart piece on top of the pillar was $20. We got everything in the well. I helped Pamela's father. Let's see, did we ever ones. escort Dampe or did we turn that off? No, I escorted Dampe. I did all of the grave. I did everything in the graveyard. I even got the secret bombable grotto there. There was nothing. Yeah, I didn't know about that. Um... Uh, we turned off randomized cows, right? I'm positive we turned off cows. Yeah. Okay. There's nothing in the path to Snowhead. I helped Camaro. We did the Dodongo Grotto. We did both of the forgery or the forging items. We fed the hungry Goron. I yeah. I did the hidden grotto on the way to Goron Village. I checked the chest in the hot spring grotto on the way to Goron Village. I did the powder keg test. We have checked the Goron shop. You put the baby Goron to sleep just by showing up as Goron Link. Yeah. We got all free chests in the Lens of Truth cave. Mm -hmm. uh, I did I did the powder keg test. I did everything related to the business scrubs, I believe. Um, that we could do. What about in the, okay, the one just, in Zora Hall? Zora Hall, I want to say, was just a heart piece above the flower, but even if even if it is in Zora Hall, that doesn't help us, because I still don't know where the mountain title beat is, and that's the one we need. Hmm. Uh, if for Zora Hall, I checked the shop. I, I don't think it was there. I played the song for Evan. He gave me, I think, $20. I did the Zora eggs. We got everything in Pirate's Fortress. Yeah. Yeah, I already did everything in the summer shop. I'm gonna check Lulu's room just to see, because it might have been the Goron Wallaby above the business strip, but again, we would still need the mountain title bead, which I don't know where that is. So we're still at the same problem, essentially. It's turning into, like, a big mystery. <laughs> yeah. Where is it? Where is the Goron Wallaby? Oh yeah, that's right. It's just a Deku stick up in this room. Okay, a stick. Nice. A stick. If I talk to him, what's he selling to Zora's? He's just selling a piece of heart. So no, that's nothing. Um. So we've done. I've done everything in Great Bay. I did everything at Pinnacle Rock. I reunited the sewers. I got the two chests there. We did everything in Pirate's Fortress. Yeah. So Great Bay is completely clear. There's nothing there. I even fed the fish. Um. We returned all Lulu's eggs, and the yes. new wave Bossa Nova didn't yes, turn into anything. That's correct. We did the Bombers Observatory. We had the Moon Cry. We found the chest behind the bombable wall. 
Uh, Anju and Cafe, I did everything related to that. Uh, I did both of Granny's stories. I went to the, I stole the reservation. I checked the chest in the reserved room. There was nothing there. I feel it must be something really simple that we're both forgetting. Oh wait, wait a second. I I think I already checked this, but I have a hunch. What's that? Um, so when you go on the path towards Akana Canyon in between Termina and Akana, there's a chest on top of a really tall pillar at the start. I th I, I think if I recall that chest is not gilded. Okay. I don't I don't remember I think one of us already checked it, but I think it was me. I'm pretty sure have, I remember having a lot of trouble what, with the respawning uh, real bomb shoes all over the place. And then I got up there and it was just like $5. Okay. Or $50 or $50 there's or also the gro There's also the grotto on the way there that you need Goron Link to punch open. I think I think I already... I think I already uh, did that. <laughs> Proxima's excited to figure out where it is. So are we, Proxima. So are we. <laughs> yeah, I got oh. a sh short time limit too before I have to go to work. Oh yeah, when do you have to go to work? Uh, in about an hour. Oh! Okay, yeah, we gotta get up. So now I know why you want to check the spoiler. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alright, well, we'll give it a couple more minutes, and if we can't find Supposedly, it... Supposedly, I should have a short shift tonight, but, you know... Yeah. I wouldn't know for sure. Come on, just took like, shot Hopefully my chest. shift would only Come be... On. Hey, Pona, I hate, I jump hate, I hate the, the controls fence. for hookshotting sometimes. Come on, just pull up. Pull yourself up there, come on. Stop so many moving off options. it! Oh my gosh, you like, can't aim the hookshot without moving big time. Yeah, I can confirm the chest over here is not gilded on top of the... Oh, I'm gonna pillar. check it anyways. Okay, it's 50 bucks. Yeah, it, it's garbage. Okay. Alright, we did everything in the grid. Um, Icona Canyon. Oh, I'm pretty sure the business scrub there is selling boop kiss. Did, okay, so you did complete the Swamp School. Yeah, that's right. It's 200 bucks in that Kirata. You did complete Swamp School Show House. Yes, it's, um, it gave garbage. I think it was $50. Yeah. We did everything. To, you did Deku Shrine in the Deku Palace. You, you talked to the monkey in the Deku Palace and got whatever the song was. Yeah, I think it was garbage. You got the chest in the Bean Cellar Grotto, right? Yeah, it was not not what we need. <laughs> I am not garbage, JP. Don't say that. Oh, man. Hold on. Hold on. Do you have an idea? I see a gilded chest that I don't think either of us have checked. Where is it? Could this be? Could it? Pendant of Memories. Oh, no, I found that one. That was one of the first ones I found. Yeah, okay, yeah. That one in the small pool. Yeah. In Terminal yeah. Field. Okay, yeah, well. Uh, Close. I killed the pea hat. I'm 99% sure I checked the bio deck with Baba Grotto. I'm pretty sure it was vanilla, but I'll check it again. Is there anything under this rock? Oh, that's the bio Deku Baba. By the way, JP, I don't know how long you've been here. We've literally checked everywhere, and we can't find the Goron Lullaby. Like, it's just not here. We are really close to just checking the spoiler to see where it is. Because I swear we've looked everywhere. school. Postman wouldn't have it. Lottery shop is not part of this. I'm gonna check the trading post again, because why not? Does it sell... Oh, no, it sells green potions. Okay. The hand in the toilet did not have it. Uh... It is a glitch of seed, JP. It most certainly is. Okay, this is killing me, because I'm, I'm, we're, eventually we're going to check the spoiler, and we're just going to see, like, oh, yep, 
Of course it was there. How did we forget about that? Uh, we did the Bombers game. We had to. Uh, we did Keaton's quiz. Yeah, I think you did Keaton's quiz. And okay, I am... Done. So, I last idea, basically, that I have at the moment. Uh, I'm going to sell a mushroom to Kotake. Okay. Oh, do I have to get another red potion in order to do that, though? I bet I do. Yeah, I think I, I think I have. Actually, wait. I've been out of ideas for a while now, so. Okay, no, that's not. I checked the spoiler. That's not randomized. It's just a red rupee. Do you want to just check the spoiler to see where it is? Because I'm out of ideas. <laughs> I give up. <laughs> okay, so do I. All right, where is Lullaby? What? That's turned off. Where is it? Apparently, it's at the statue where we get the Song of Soaring normally. But I turned that off. That's supposed to be vanilla. It's at the Song of Soaring statue? Yes! But... I could have sworn that I walked right past that thing and it didn't even do anything. No, you have to press you A have, next to it. You have, it, to, cl you have every, to click on it? In every single seed I have done before this, it has always been a recovery heart. Every single time. That's dumb. I literally... Because we started with the Song of Soaring and I sit... Oh my gosh, I bet I didn't check exclude Song of Soaring. I bet you that's- I bet you I literally just accidentally didn't check the box. Well, we're about to find out. I suppose I could have just soared into Woodfall and gone that way, but no. Check. Notes are carved. Da -da, intro became the Goron Lullaby. What? <sighs> okay. That's annoying because that shouldn't have been there. That literally should not have happened. Because it was I, I checked the box. It was only there because of stupid. Okay. It was well. literally just there because either I accidentally clicked a box that shouldn't have been clicked, or because I actually no, it must have been that. I literally must have just accidentally clicked a box that should not have been clicked. So this should not have happened. So we should have gotten this way, way, way early. Well. Now we've got a race, basically. <laughs> That's really dumb, because I literally always check. Yeah. Race is on, and it looks like heartache. All right, I'm glad. I'm glad we looked that up. I would never have found that because I thought that I thought that location was turned off. It's not my fault. I literally didn't change the settings from how I've always played, and I've always had that location deactivated. Don't- I said play the freaking ocarina, not turn into a Zora. Well, at least I can beat Snowhead quickly. And we got Stone Tower Temple music in here. Am I gonna mark it? Um, I probably should on my tracker, but no, I'm not in the mood right now. My question is, can I beat this place in a? Uh, it's 7 p.m. on the night on the final night. Can I still beat this place in time? Oh yeah. Snowhead Temple is not that hard, and especially since I mean, we literally just have to get the boss key and get to the boss door. I'm trying to think. Do we, I think we only need one small key in the whole dungeon. And that does require me to remember how the dungeon works, and I don't. Okay, well, fair enough. That's the wrong. Bring up my tracker. There, I have the Goron Lullaby. Are you happy, JP? Are you happy? Are you glad that you can see that glowing Lullaby on the tracker? <laughs> I, I just... I'm just a little ticked off that we've literally been searching for freaking hours for an item that was in a place that should have been turned off. 
<laughs> I'm more just annoyed that I had to go for a stone tower temple and it didn't get me anything. That's my least favorite dungeon to have to go for. Okay, well, I'm raising up the central pillar. Luckily, I know where the small keys are. This this just became a race, I think. <laughs> yeah, it, it pretty much is a race at this point. All right, if I if I push the block here, will it save its location? Oh wait, actually, this isn't even the ideal thing to do. That's this is not the way I'm supposed to go. I love how we're getting right. the stone tower music in here. It's just the map. Arrows, that's what I needed. Thank you. Rats. That made the chest appear, not the door. <laughs> no, no worries, JP. I know that we're just messing around. <laughs> it's more just <laughs> spending hours searching for one thing like that. It's a little annoying. Although I have a great it's title for the awful. video. And what's even worse is <laughs> I'm really glad that this was a co-op seed because if I had to search, if I had to search for that myself, I. I literally would have had to search every place by myself and it would have taken twice as long. Nobody wants that. It also occurred to me that, like, basically no matter what happens, you're going to reach the moon first because I still have to wait for the clock tower to open and you won't. <laughs> yeah. Randomizers are fun until you have to find one specific item and check every single place. Especially the places you hate. Okay, well, I made my way up to the boss door, but forgot where the boss key is. Oh. Yeah, I don't remember where the boss key is. It's simultaneously very close to the boss door and very far from the boss door. Spatially yeah, I think I, I think I vaguely see the location of where it is and Actually, vaguely you, recall. I think you can take the Deku flower at the very top and take it to yeah, the I might, top. and just fly over there, yeah. Yeah, I, I think you can do that. Honestly, why else would this Deku flower be here? If not to shortcut this part. Rolled off a cliff. That would have been really embarrassing. Oh man, wait. Oh no. Did you fall? <laughs> no, it's whiz rope. Oh. Oh dang. So actually, you don't even need to get any small keys if you want to. Yeah, right? I don't think you need any small keys for this dungeon. I've, I thought you. What the heck? These stupid Wizalfos just pushed me really far back. What the heck? Yeah, most of the difficulty of this dungeon uh... just. <laughs> The gates in this dungeon are just blocked off by needing fire. Sorry, arrows. JP. No efforts when the family friendly tag is on. <laughs> uh oh. I need to find some more arrows, <laughs> otherwise, I'm gonna have a hard time against Wizard Rope. <laughs> oh, thank goodness. Not having the compass makes things slightly more difficult, but not that bad. 
Oh yes, yeah, Scarecrow Soul. Scarecrow Soul is great. It appears in tons of places. Yeah. Where Oh yeah, I have Twin Mold's remains. I totally forgot to <laughs> mark that down. <laughs> I always forget to mark the boss remains. You at goat yet? Yes, much better, JP. Yes, 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 we know. Goat is inside the uh, ice block. He exists. Oh, no. He is Nintendo a. Nintendo is going to beat me. Oh, oh no. <laughs> hmm. I wonder, is Fierce Duty's mask actually going to make Goat easier? Um. Easier? No. Faster, maybe. I mean, I'd still have to knock him down with the Goron's mask, yeah? Yeah. And by the time you change to the Fierce Deity Mask, like... I don't know. I, f I find it's a little faster with Fierce Deity, but not by much. He's he's the boss that Fierce Deity doesn't make it a lot easier. Much like Twin Mold. Oh man, you played this dungeon a lot smarter than I did. Don't fall off. I also should have made it Night of the Final Day before coming here. Whoops. I don't want to point the... I don't want to point in... Wait. Uh, I'm gonna lose to another randomizer seat. Both of the times we've done, like, co-op randomizer seats, you've beaten me. <laughs> <laughs> that was almost a really bad thing. <laughs> that was almost really bad. I would have been so ticked if the, I had fallen off there. <laughs> Alright. Uh, Fierce Deity Mask. Let's fight the masked mechanical monster. Goat. I don't know if this method's really faster than just doing it the normal way, but it's working. A great fairy <laughs> sword might be faster, actually, than... Eh, no, Fierce Deity sword is, I think, more powerful. Well, that worked. I mean, my strategy was just to stand there, wait till he rounds the corner towards with the Fierce Deity's mask, and as soon as he starts approaching me, I just luck, I just hold Z and just starts tapping the B button and starts shooting beams at him. It doesn't knock him over, but it still damages what do you, him. What do you after mean that didn't kill him? He is literally on fire right now. <laughs> yeah, it takes like four or five passes, but he does die. What the? Okay, Goat's behaving just erratically. He should be dead, but he's not. Oh, hey, the mountain title deed. Oh, that's where we I found am. it. <laughs> That's what Goat drops. Oh, you and yep. I beat Goat at almost the exact same time, then. Yeah, you. Yeah, I guess whatever strategy were you were using playing it normally is faster. I didn't play it normally. I did Fierce Deity Link. I just got a lot of wax in. I don't know why it didn't kill him, though. He was, like, literally on fire when he started running off. <laughs> yeah, I don't care about no mountain title deed. I'm just getting the 20 rupees. <laughs> <laughs> this is a race now. Except you're going, you're going to win the race because I still have to make it night of the final day and then wait till midnight. You have to wait substantially less time. Actually, you might. Yes, have made even even more substantially less by the fact that I have um. Cheats. Oh well, if you use cheats, <laughs> come on now. <laughs> cheats, namely the speed up key. That's true. Well, yeah, I'm not gonna beat that then. But even if I wasn't using the turbo key, yeah, I've got you beat because it's almost midnight. I wish Grandma was still here so I could just listen to her stories five times. I should have so I should have advanced to the final day before entering the dungeon. That was stupid of me. 
Yeah, even with Song of Double Time, you'll still have to wait six in-game hours. Yeah. Oh, well, while I wait, while I wait, I might as well check some of the stuff that is here in Snowhead that we didn't get. That we couldn't get because it was blocked. Nothing better to do. So, invisible chest behind the waterfall contains... A red potion! Whoopee! And all the children. Okay, I'm not gonna bother checking any of the moon stuff. I'm just gonna run straight to the uh, Majora's Mask Kid, put on Fierce Duty's Mask, and whack him. Darn it. Will you play with me? You have only weak masks. Well, shall we go? Wow, you got the really weak masks. Back. Weak masks. Ooh. We'll just see about that, boyo. Behold, the mighty powers of locking on and tapping the B button over and over. Okay, no idea what the first phase music is. Well, I'll f I might figure it out. I still couldn't figure out what Grey Bay Temple's music was. Though. It really sounded like a ghost house music. It's an interesting theme, I just have no idea what it's from. I recognize most of the songs here. Okay, so there are two underwater chests now. Well, let's see if I recognize the second theme. Oh it's the normal Majora's Mask boss theme. Or, or it's the it's just the normal boss theme. Oh, I love the normal boss theme a ton. Do 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 do. Well, he fell I down. I literally can hear Majora's incarnation screaming from through your <laughs> this microphone. Yeah. <sighs> and Majora's Brass theme is the same as it what it usually is. I don't think that ever gets randomized. Which is fine because it's a cool theme. If only my speed up. He actually hit me because I wasn't tapping B enough. And he's dead. Oh, good for you. I'm so glad you and your speed up key were able to beat it before me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I yeah, I cheated a lot, but hey, it's it's done. And we both got stuck at pretty much the same points and ended up accomplishing the same things. I think we both made progress. Da -da 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 -da. I don't know why it doesn't let me speed up my game. Oh, that seems to be sped up. Okay. Apparently I can speed it up to 200%, but not 400%. This is a very boring time. Dawn of a new day, and it looks like the credits and final sequence all play out normally. Alright, then I'm going to check the spoiler log just to see what we didn't get. Cool. Which is very little. <laughs> yeah, we we found yeah, we checked so everything. In town archery two is a piece of heart. Uh, what else? These kitties are very hungry. Meow. Yes, they're screeching at me. It's past their feeding time. <laughs> the frog choir gives a piece of heart. Mm -hmm. uh, Goron yes, Race gave twenty dollars because we enforced that to be junk. Mm -hmm. Um, oh, I'm curious what the mountain title deed leads to. Uh, oh, just $20. That's not good. Then on the moon... Uh, the moon had two pieces of heart, the adult wallet, the couple's mask, a silver rupee, a purple, a purple rupee, and the largest quiver. Hmm. And what did the mayor have then? Clock Town. The mayor had twenty dollars. Big surprise. <laughs> what a cheapskate. Yeah. Okay. Well, that was fun. I'm going to go feed the kitties now. Alrighty.
I think we can pretty much wrap this up. Yeah. Thanks for joining in. This is a lot of fun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Maybe next time we'll get a seed that uh, isn't Doesn't so crummy. Doesn't suck. <laughs> and that we won't, you know, flail around so much in because we forgot to press a button. Yeah. That was... That was the thing. Anyhow, have a good day at work and say hi to the kitties. <laughs> okay. See ya. See ya. Bye. <laughs> and that is when Artie realized he did not have the old tour. Just kidding. Oh man, this freaking seed, man. I definitely had a lot of fun with it, but holy cow, this freaking seed, man. <laughs> Come on, just talk to this kid. Talk to the freaking kid. You think I only had <laughs> Are you calling me weak? Let's put an end to this, shall we? comes his incarnation. That's it for Majora's Mask Randomizer. Thanks for everyone for joining in. Holy cow, that was an annoying seed, but I'm really glad Nintendo had joined in for that, because that made it a whole lot more fun. Next time, we'll be a little more careful with the rules, and hopefully we'll get a better seed, because literally, if if I literally hadn't... I don't even know if I accidentally just clicked a box that I shouldn't have, or didn't click a box I should have. I don't think I changed any of the rules compared to what I normally do, but... Whatever, apparently that happens, so... If that hadn't happened, though, we would have finished the seed hours earlier, so, well, anyhow, hope you guys have a great rest of your night, and God bless.